Hair, hairline? Oh, my hair Brenda. is itchy. No, you're good. You're good, sis. <laughs> Period. <laughs> ah. I mean, oh my god. <laughs> With all these lines. <laughs> what a beautiful <laughs> chocolate <laughs> man! <laughs> <laughs> Edna Mood. One. And we're back. We're back. Here at the Cozy Show in the Cozy Corner. You're here with your host, Hi Ornelas, my co-host, Chris Mariscal. We're joined by two, you know, seen before guests, mm-hmm. looking a little different than before. So you guys have to introduce yourselves in case. I'm Brenda. I'm Marina. Now they dyed their hair, so we thought, like, oh, we have to wear a wig, <laughs> you know? <laughs> yeah, so we just, grew out our hair. We just wanted to make them feel a little more comfortable. This is the cozy show, after all, you yeah. know? So, you know, it's, it's what we do. What, what you made know? you guys choose that color? Honestly, I don't know. Just like I think I dreamt about it, and I was like, I have to do that. You mm. know, it's a power move, and yeah, I just I think it just fits. Marina? And me growing it's kinda up, kind of like a Katy Perry California mm. Girls type of mm, vibe. Almost mm. summer. Yeah, right. I was invited to the video, but she oh. turned it down. I got to sick. be here. Anyway, oh. sorry, Marina. <laughs> um, I watched a lot of Scooby Doo growing up, uh-huh. so mm. you know. Just felt right. See, it's funny because when she walked in, Jaime said, "Oh, you look like <laughs> you look like Scooby Doo," and they're like, "She doesn't fucking have orange hair in Scooby Doo." <laughs> I did not. <laughs> like, all of a sudden, when the cameras are on, I, I didn't know, say that. Changes. I literally agreed with you. I don't know what's going on. Okay. Well, we're gaslighting a lot this episode. <laughs> we got the wigs. <laughs> oh I God. literally was agreeing with you. We just came back from Coachella. So. <laughs> <laughs> I heard um, Frank, Frank Ocean, Ocean. Like, didn't sing. Okay. Well, real quick. <laughs> I know uh, we're kind of off the good content that you guys are listening to right now, but we have to announce our sponsor, Mosaic. Uh, Mosaic is a clothing brand that has some pretty cool shit, if I do say so myself. It's not wigs, <laughs> but they got shirts, hoodies, sweats. Um, hats, windbreakers now, too. Yeah, so some banging dope. graphic tees, whatever your little heart desires. Um Go check them out. Uh, they have a bunch of shit on the website. They're always coming out with new stuff, too. Small local business located here in the Central Valley. Mm. Go ahead and support them. Started by a Brazilian uh, immigrant. You know, he's poor. Father. He is, you know. Yeah. <laughs> so he's a single him. father. He's 5'5". Five five, <laughs> and that's true. <laughs> he makes no money. Yeah. But go check them out. Wait, uh, they got some bitch new clothes. Small local business. Um, <laughs> free shipping. If you live in the 209 area, uh, you know, you'll get that bitch dropped off for free. That's a good deal. I'll take advantage of that. On top of that, you can use code COZY, all caps, C-O-Z-Y, uh, for 10% off at checkout. And uh, another additional 10% off if it's your first time uh, shopping there. If you sign up for the little newsletter, put the email down, you know what I'm saying? Put the little burner email, you know, nobody has to know. Ah. Uh, go check them out, mosaicapparel.com, at mosaicapparel on Instagram. Good homie, Chago Richie. Check him out. Anything and else? Real quick, they have we have a collab shirt that's oh, Cozy yep. Show Colors with his logo. So try to wear that and uh, order that one if you guys can. You oh my good. gosh, you wore this. That looks good. That's nice. Good. Mosaic Apparel, check him out. Yep. Hey, Wait, what's what? the whole scandal no, with no, that? No, no, no. I heard I the backstory so on that though. Yeah, me too. And I respect it. Okay, Brenda so, first, then we'll get, hear your backstory. I don't know why he didn't perform, but apparently he was, like, on the side of the stage. Like, people couldn't even see him. He wasn't, like, out. And apparently he only he was only there for, like, half an hour. And then the people he brought out, he was just kind of vibing along with him. He didn't sing at all, like, mm. with the featured songs. Oh. Um, and then his songs, I think he only did, like, three, three or four songs. Yeah. And, like, that was it, because he was, like, an hour late. And people oh, were, like, shit. camping out there for, like, fucking hours. Yeah. I mean, not camping, but they ran as soon as, like, the doors opened. And they were sitting... Like waiting for him. Yeah. From death. Marina, can you give yeah. us the backstory here? Well, I saw a video of like he like went on stage and explained he talked about did his brother pass away? Thought, yeah, a couple years ago. Okay, so he said something like he hasn't performed in a long time and one thing him and his brother would do was go to Coachella and they would oh, just vibe out to the artist, you know what I mean? Yeah. Like just exactly what he was doing on the stage. In a, I mean, I get it because a lot of people are like, oh, my God, Frank Ocean. But he gave this backstory before he even, like, started his performance. And then I feel like he got a lot of backlash for, like, yeah. just vibing out the same way he used to vibe out with his brother. Mm. You know what I mean? I, I feel like know. hella people have been posting Frank Ocean, like, songs in their stories more these last few days. And I'm like, is everybody just trying to flex it now just because he's, like, yeah, you know? But I feel yeah. like he's always been, like, well, good. 
when I talked to Frank and I asked him about it, <laughs> <laughs> he said, honestly, I was just a little hungover and I didn't want to do it. Yeah. Yeah. Said, I'll you forward you guys the video I saw because I know I liked it on TikTok. I, no, I saw it too. I think when he was doing like his explanation and yeah, like it seems like that was kind of probably his reason. Mm-hmm. I'm sure he just doesn't really care either. Like, like yeah. he just wants to enjoy it, like what he would have done yeah. with his brother. Like he doesn't really care about these, you know. Yeah. But like also he knew like he was gonna be. This isn't like that's the only thing. He knew he was gonna be at Coachella. Yeah. Like how are you gonna be an hour late? Well, just and don't. Like, you but know I feel I mean? like a don't lot of artists are late regardless of who they are. I always. feel like don't yeah. do um don't do like a crazy ass event if you only want to just vibe. Yeah. Like I mean you could just vibe in the audience. He could have just vibed, but maybe he wanted to see, vibe with his fans. I see a little bit of both. Like <laughs> the for the both. fans and especially like. It's not their job to have a backstory, you know? Yeah. Like, yeah. you're only going to get what you get. And if I were to, like, wait for a few hours and only have that, I'd be pretty disappointed, you know? Yeah. Yeah. But, like, they chose to wait, you know? It's not like but they expected something. I know, that's true. Yeah. And, yeah, and like, hella people were like, Half oh, an hour, come on. I can't wait to watch his set, like, live on YouTube, too. So it's fucking yeah, crazy because it's yeah, like... Sure. No, I heard they weren't going to live stream <laughs> his. So that's why so many people were waiting to try mm. to get a good spot. He was, like, one of the people they weren't going to live stream. I feel like I'd have a fucking panic attack if I went to Coachella. Yeah. Like, oh as a viewer, gosh. it just seems like there's so many goddamn people. I feel like I'd fucking lose my mind. Where is it at? Uh, in Palm Springs? Oh, I thought, like, Palm Springs. India? India? Indio. Indio. Oh. <laughs> no <laughs> way. Like, damn. You, you look like a Karen like and you fucking think you like one, too. <laughs> India. <laughs> Ew. <laughs> That's so gross. Did you guys hear about, like, um, if the artist went past, like, curfew, they got charged, like, a fine of like 10 grand That's fucking ridiculous Per minute They're literally like What makes that shit happen Like how yeah. is there a curfew In the middle of the de- desert Yeah Like yeah, curfew Yeah isn't it, isn't the, it warm the people like Oh I thought you meant like Past their like set time No 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 It's like past Like 11pm yeah, no, that is it That's what you should say <coughs> Like the past artists. their yeah. like Increment of stage time Or past like Like curfew Like a certain like time the Of the evening public curfew Yeah Oh shit Sounds yeah. like your dad. But it's, <laughs> That's what I was it's saying. like that with like all concerts. Like even here, like if they extend, it's because it's already set. Like they have the crew that they need. All right. <laughs> hey, who's been to hella concerts here? Me. Fucking not all you. Right? So don't even try to come at me, bitch. Well, <laughs> ugly as we. Grupo Firme. <laughs> um, so Grupo good. Firme actually, the one I went to with Grupo Firme, they extended and they said. Then they were like, fuck it, fuck it, we'll pay the fee. And then oh, people shit. were like, oh, tra, oh, tra. Mm-hmm. And they were like, yeah, no, yeah, no. Like, <laughs> like shit, never mind. Like, <laughs> yeah, no, it's like. Because they have to get everybody out at a certain point and then they go clean up. Like, it's like the whole crew thing, you know, they have to be out of there at a certain time and mm. like they rent that spot. So, but I think it's like for every, like every event. I remember, like, sorry, freshman year, they had the Summerfest thingy and like the Turlock Fairgrounds or whatever. And they had Ray Schremer come on Ooh. and there was like so many fucking bands like all day and all i wanted to do was just see ray Schremer. like i didn't know anybody else and they fucking came on at like 10 p.m and i think like the like the fucking all the lights turned off and like their equipment shut down and they were like uh, it was like weird because there was rumors that they just like didn't want to perform or some shit but then I th- and then they're like, oh, they just faked it, like all their fucking equipment turn off and shit. And then they were on stage and they're like, they're fucking kicking us out. They're not letting us perform. And everybody's like, fuck you to Ray Schremer. They're like throwing shit on the oh, stage. Shit. Oh my so gosh. to this day, I don't know what happened, but that was like we pretty saw, disappointing. We saw Sean Kingston at Turlock Fairgrounds. Oh yeah, I he remember put that. on a show. I had a COVID show? that day. Oh. <laughs> and you still <laughs> went? No, no. We, oh, I didn't know. Yeah. Damn. Luckily, her and Emily didn't get it because I was and like, she probably got COVID there because that's didn't know. how many people were there. No, I got COVID Saturday. Sean Kingston was a Monday. COVID's not even that real. COVID honestly. was like Tuesday. <laughs> no, no, oh my God. Kingston, no, no, no. Let me tell God, you. Might as well give him a gun. Oh, wow. <laughs> no, let me tell you something that I just about? found out today. All my so, kids need is God. <laughs> period. He will guide them. But hold on. Madness. Today, you know, I work in a pharmacy and uh-huh. we get um, alerts yeah. from like the, I don't know what it is, from the board of pharmacy. And literally. <laughs> <laughs> There's such a thing from Mr. No, Pharmacy? No, seriously. From Mr. Pharmacy No, himself. seriously, there's a thing. From Big but Pharma? The monovalent is no longer the like... I the fuck polygamy The kind of monovalent things. is like the first COVID <laughs> vaccination. It's like no longer FDA approved and it's like you're... Like, they don't have them anymore. They're not making them anymore Wait, and they're not going the to FDA. make them anymore. I mean, once <laughs> they said the kids have to eat certain things for my lunches... Yeah. I said, oh, no, I know. No, no. Like when they took the ice cream out of the vending machines at school... I mean, crazy. when Michelle crazy. Obama was president, that was awful. That was awful for us. Yeah. You know, they wanted them to eat apples. I mean, yeah. 
fucking mm. whole wheat tortillas with the chili verde at lunch. <laughs> oh, are you yeah. kidding me? I mean, the chili verde. my kids are used to white food. And I'm not saying there's anything wrong with Mexican food. But when you introduce a kid <laughs> right. like that in that hey, early age, right. you suscept them to certain things. Tammy, uh-huh. Tammy, aren't you from Guatemala? I mean, I was. <laughs> <laughs> I just not really part of that anymore now that mm. with my husband. I, mean, I live in America, so I speak English. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Speak English. What was that laugh, Tammy? Eng- English. Do you understand me? <laughs> Comprende? Bitch. <laughs> <laughs> Ugly ass. Uh, um, do you think you guys, the whole throwing stuff at people, do you think? <laughs> <laughs> back when That's they used to throw tomatoes back. at people, I feel like that would relieve a lot of stress. You know, like if they had someone that was like a murderer just or something like that, like just fastball. Imagine like <laughs> after working for 40 cents, a murderer. Know? Or so I don't know how they do it. Like, I don't think they like throw tomatoes. I think they'd be throwing stones. <laughs> Even better. <laughs> they would stone That'd be to fucked death. back in the day. Can you yeah. imagine? You think you'd partake? Yeah, I would. Yeah, it depends on the crime. What if it was like a <clears throat> yeah? If it was like a rapist, serial rapist. Like, Hell yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Sign me up. Damn. <laughs> I and think I would. Sell me those stones. That'd be like normal back then. So but like, like, fuck it, dude. Are you going to the stoning? <laughs> I'm going to the stoning. <laughs> <laughs> dude, stones at six. That was at seven. Oh shit. Hey, stones at six. Wine at my place. Then get stoned after. Hey. <laughs> All right, that wasn't socially acceptable. It, that cigarette. <clears throat> That's not being. <laughs> you're <stoned>. smoking <laughs> lavender. It's good for stress relief. <laughs> oh, you're right. You're right. <laughs> sorry, sorry. Um, so Jaime got his fucking tax returns. What did you do today? I got my taxes. I did my you taxes. Went to your tax appointment, right? Yes. So you did your taxes. Yeah. So I went over there, got my taxes. I mean, as a middle class white woman, it's really hard. <laughs> it's really hard because all these underprivileged kids, they just get everything. No. So uh, I only got seventeen hundred back. I mean, pff, you know. Why do I feel like Hyben's gonna get canceled on this podcast? <laughs> you can't cancel me for speaking my truth. I mean, since when did words become illegal? Oh my God. Is the First Amendment a thing or not? Did we? Did we do I mean, something did we, different? Did we not fight for that? <laughs> my not ancestors people defending our country every day for our freedoms. My ancestors might have lost the Civil War, but we got the First <laughs> Amendment. Okay. <laughs> Anyways, I got I got seventeen hundred dollars back, wow. which is really good. No, that's really good. <laughs> I was expecting to pay because your boy making free to lay money now, you know. Yeah. Jeez. But luckily, I I got some <laughs> I got some money back, yeah, boy. dude. And it's so <laughs> stressful. They, they yeah, it's I like saw this meme today and it said I think I know which one you're talking about. <laughs> it's, it said are you, are you talking about pronouns? It said oh. let me she them titties. <laughs> that is not the meme I thought you were talking about. I thought oh. we were still talking about taxes. Anyways, so <laughs> you got 1700? <laughs> um, yeah, have you guys done your taxes? Yeah, I'm getting <laughs> I just thought about Brenda's tax return price and what she's getting back, and it made me laugh. But um, I'm getting about a thousand fifty-six. Nice. I made like fucking zero money this year, so I have no <laughs> idea what I'm gonna make because I was bum ass certified gone? for so long. Yeah, am I gonna go to jail for not doing my shit? Jail. You have till like April. I thought uh, you had to like be April. June. I thought today April is tax is day. A- April 18th it's is tomorrow. The, um, no, it's today. It's on yeah, the it's calendar the deadline. as today. But I asked. But I hear her, there's like an extension. There's an extension. She but said. it's if. You're in flooded areas, and we did not flood. <laughs> well, I asked. Like, I'm fucking in the flood with all this drip, okay? <laughs> <laughs> Take a picture in me. the bathtub. I'm, I'm flooded. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> you did a little car, like a toy car in the water. Like, my car got flooded. I mean, <laughs> no, I asked her. I was like, is there an extension? She's like, I think they're trying to extend it to October. I think? But she's like, I but she's think? like, there's Isn't hella. she the one doing your Wait, taxes? So actually, what happens, like, to me? Because Jail. Because I haven't done them. No, is that like I think it's probably like a late fee. Me doesn't know shit. I think (laughs) it's after like a certain amount of times that you don't like file taxes, like you go to jail. Yeah, bro. If Lindsay could do her taxes seven years late, we'll be okay. (laughs) Yeah, she makes hella money. (laughs) Yeah, you'll be okay. But But you just do that like ASAP. Yeah, I think I'm gonna hit her up tomorrow. Shout out Blanca. Shout out Blanca. Shout out Blanca if you want to do your taxes. Not an official sponsor, but she's actually really cool. We'll be soon. She's really good. She won't know if there's an extension though. Yeah, she won't know. (laughs) I'm, I'm no, I did hear something. I don't know. My manager was talking about it the other day. Uh, she's like, oh, I don't want to do my taxes. So once I heard there was an extension, I was like, I'm going to wait. <laughs> Damn. Oh, yeah. My sister hasn't done her taxes, Alex. And uh-huh. she's pretty on it. So she's probably not. And my dad either. <laughs> he's um, pretty uh, on it. Not deal oh, well. But he's, deal a, he's, you know, Sean he always, he's a procrastinator. It's all right. All right. Sorry. Um, wait, real quick. Sorry. Brenda, how, how much did you get back? Oh, yeah. <coughs> a solid. So last year <laughs> I had um, three jobs. Mm. Damn. And um, on each Babysitting one. Babysitting is like a hobby. <coughs> huh? 
Like, she gets more paid like legally for that. Like <coughs> taxes legally. taken out yeah. and everything. Wow. Shit. And Dude. she gets sick days and vacation hours. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. So take your okay, hobby. Never, never mind. Period. <laughs> Um, so I did three jobs last year <clears throat> and apparently, I don't know if it's for sure, but I didn't put like on under dependence, like before I start, it's a w, the du- w, the W4, <laughs> the mm-hmm. W4, like before I start, I'm, I guess I'm supposed to put zero, but I don't know if I put zero or anything. The point is that because there was multiple jobs, I think they, I don't know, but they didn't take out enough, like each paycheck I you, get, you they should have taken one. out more. Because that's what I used to do at Kohl's, and I used to not get a lot back, and then now I put it at zero, and this is the most I've ever gotten back. I just, they just haven't given me that paper. Maybe I did, and I'm just fucking stupid, and I just didn't, you know, I was like, accept. I used to do some shit like that at Kohl's, too, and my mom was like, you're fucking yourself. No, I literally think whenever I was filling out my paperwork, because I... It was like a group. And you were like 17. You're like, I don't know what the fuck Yeah, to do. I want to yeah. say they told me like, you could put one. And I was like, okay. So one I for one. what? Dependent? Yeah, but like, like you have a dependent? Oh. Yeah. So I, I think was I did that, that too. But well, don't you have to do that? Don't you just say but like. No, because my mom was claiming me as a dependent. So uh, the, it was, the government oh, was probably like, what the fuck are you That's bad, actually. Mm. Yeah. Right. You can't claim yourself and someone claim you. I had to fucking well. amend my taxes because of that. <laughs> <laughs> I swear to God. Dude, it was like a whole year process. Uh. I, I, I'm, I'm still in it. <laughs> God, you haven't done it still? Uh, I sent the, um, the the letter back. Where I'm just waiting for the IRS to get, well. get back to me. Have has been more on his shit lately? You know what I'm saying? You know what? Me too. He left not his person in my car Not in the like, weeks, legal but. world, but I've been... I've been Ew. making my bed every day. <laughs> and that's, that's a win. I don't even do that. Hey, would you yeah, eat your boogers as a kid? No, <laughs> I'm I get very grossed out easily with a lot of things and I think stems way back. So I don't know, but I think that would make me vomit in my mouth if I did that. I, I tried I, them for I sure. I think I did that. I don't know you if I did like it. Play doh. I know. I used to fucking lick the fuck out of play doh. Really? <laughs> yeah. Lick it? Really? Lick play doh. That shit's salty. Damn. It's like a fucking I pouch think of salt. Lick, I think I've tasted it, but I don't think I would eat it consistently <laughs> or lick it. I used to lick like coins. I loved like pennies and yeah, shit because they're so metallic. You're missing and it's iron like, or oh, what? Cause it was good. I remember I accidentally swallowed a penny one time and I was like, no. <laughs> <laughs> it's like right there, like the, like the they Joker. Just, when it's literally, like the <sighs> they don't do anything except wait for you to pass it. Literally. Yeah. Like, I mean, what are you going to do? I and mean, that's why my mom said, she's like, no, no, come out and you poop. So they the metal detector every time. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> never came out. Yeah. What else do you guys do as a kid that's weird? Anything? I used to cut my hair. I used to get in trouble all the time at really? school with like safety scissors. Oh, I remember wow. one time, like, I don't have a good memory of whenever I was a kid, but one thing I do remember is that one of the teachers put my hair in a bag <laughs> and <laughs> gave it to my mom and said <laughs> she cut her hair today. Damn. And I got in so much trouble, but it's fine. I'll never forget do that. You, do you know what like urged you to to want to cut it? Maybe because my grandma is a hairdresser, so I thought, oh, I'm like, oh this is fine, cool. Tanya? Yeah, yeah. Is she the one that I met? Yes, oh, you did dog. Her. I feel like cutting your hair isn't as bad because, like, you're just kind of fucking it up a little bit. <laughs> like, but pulling is bad. I had my bangs probably, like, all the way up here. Yeah, okay. I remember when I used to have uh, Bieber hair. I don't think you guys have ever seen that. But I used to have Bieber hair that I would flip and shit. And I remember I went to this, uh, this friend's, like, birthday party. And her little brother, who was, like, eight years old, really liked my hair. And then a few days later... I heard that he cut his hair because he was like, oh, I wanted to make it look like Chris's hair. And his like, mom told my oh mom. Oh, my God. Was his like, mom wow. was probably like, that guy could never come over <laughs> again. <laughs> I don't even remember how old I was. It was probably like fucking, I don't know, 12 or something. Oh, wait. Okay, so I got $7. <laughs> oh, yeah. My tax. $7? $7? $7? Well, explain yeah. why. <clears throat> oh, they okay, might so well. <laughs> That's I the mailing fee. <laughs> I paid se- $70 to file them, right? Yeah. I got back. I'm not doing the math correctly because I can't remember the numbers. I owe... I don't, can't remember if it's federal or state. I owe like 140, but then I was getting back like two something. Uh, but if mm. I owe 140 and I already paid seventy dollars to file them, I did the math. The point is, I ended up with like seven dollars. And that day, <laughs> Marina and I went to go get fucking corn dogs, like the Korean corn dogs with the hot Cheetos. Oh, I've never had those. And the oh my gosh, inside. Oh man. And um. Yes. Oh, I paid. Okay, I paid for them. I paid for them that day because Marina was on her way there. Yeah. And then she was like, 
you can't use your fucking refund, your tax refund on me. And I was like, hey, I got she it. Wasn't, uh, she wasn't wanting me to it. pay her back. And then she's like, no, I got it. And then I was like, Brenda, I'm mean? not going to let you use your whole tax refund on me right now. <laughs> you have three jobs, though. You would think, you know. Yeah, Blanca, give us some feedback. But I guess it's just like <laughs> the government can't keep up with me. <laughs> Does she actually watch? I don't know. Well, no. she will. I'll, I'll let her watch. Any questions you want to ask Blanca? Like, um, I'll make her watch this one. No, I kind of understood why, though. Like, I have no dependents. I didn't put any school last year. I didn't. Yeah. The only thing I put was, like, that I paid the, um, what's the thing called on your car? The sticker? Your A registration. registration. That's the only thing I put down. It's I didn't even crazy. need to put that. I didn't do that <laughs> either. That. that was normal. <laughs> I think they just well no you have to go in and pay actually it's like 250 oh, bucks I pay registration but like I no yeah I didn't know you taxes. can claim that yeah. Yeah, yeah. she was like oh, yeah, she I'll felt bad it. for me she was like is there anything <laughs> Anything. <laughs> anything. Anything. We could say Dutch Bros is an addic- addiction. <laughs> Seriously. You were like, these gas prices, <laughs> um, can I put that on there? <laughs> no, yeah, and I was like, uh. And then they had the guy, like the main guy, like come in. He like checks like all the stuff before like they finish them. And he goes, I wish I had better news for you. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> Wait, so you get them done somewhere, right? Yeah, I go and they do them for me. Damn, they still fucked it up. Huh? Hey, they did. <laughs> what about you, Marina? You go to somewhere? Um, No, one of my mom's friends does them. Um, she charges like 40 bucks. Really? Yeah. I saw. I used to go me. to this. My whole family would go to this one lady in Turlock, but she's just fucking. She's kind of rude. Mm-hmm. She's really rude. What's and then the last name? time, and it was. I don't know if I should out her. We could talk about it. What's later. her name? Because okay, my parents. Yeah, used never to, mind. Because we're saying, saying her lady, occupation and bitch. name. We can't do that. Yeah, and that, that she bad? lives yeah. in Turlock. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I know. That's a lot. Very specific. Wait, say it and bleep it, because I want. Tax lady. Oh no. Never okay. Mind. Anyways, um, she's just hella rude and like weird and just. Like, the last time I went, she just kept lecturing me about, like, how I need to get my master's degree and, like, well, not, it was just the way she was saying it. She was just so condescending, you know? She was like, oh, what are you going to school for? I like, psychology. And she's like, are you going to get your master's? And I was like, no. And then she was like, you're going to want it. You're going to need to get your master's. <laughs> I was like, you're going to want to shut the fuck up. <laughs> like, <laughs> what the fuck? You were like, lady, you're doing my taxes I, right now. Don't she worry about br- me. Dude, she kept bringing it up. And she's like, yeah, my fucking, like, niece just got her master's and, like, you know, it's the only way she's making good money and this and that. And I was like, fuck you, you know? So I'm like, I'm going to switch to his lady because... Yeah, when I was going over there, I, I literally... She'll probably lecture me too, but, you know, yeah, but I, was, cool way. I just I just say that I hate gay people because she's a lesbian. <laughs> <laughs> and I was like, with the taxes, I was like, oh my God, all my taxes are just going to the gays now. <laughs> you know? I just don't think they should be getting married. I just don't think they should be getting money. I mean, it's one thing if you want to give it to yourselves, but you're taking away from real normal people. And to think that they have... Trans? Is that how you call them? No. People I, coming into every our day. kindergartens and reading to our children? Reading. I mean, should we really be subjecting them to such obscurity? Not at that age. At that age? <laughs> Maybe 25. You know and that's early. Oh. And these drag shows, don't even get me started. <laughs> what a drag. I mean, all the free money they get. Would you guys ever go to a drag show? I feel like I would. Yeah. I, I see hella like people going. I just don't want to give away the money. I would go, but I'm just like, I don't want to feel like that fucking cheap guy who's like not Why, giving money, you know? Because Lindsay told you don't fucking go to a strip club if you're not going to spend hella money. I told her, wait, she wasn't disappointed in me, right? I think she understood because it was like your first time or something. And we bought a dance. Yeah, we bought a dance. Have you guys been in a strip club? No. Do we should all go together. We should. Wait, can you wait, get in, Brenda? It, is it 21? I think you have to go to a non-alcohol one. But, I mean, she's going to be 21 in August. January, February, March, April, May, June, July, August. It's not January. It's Let's face it. With how April. long it takes us to coordinate shit, it'll yeah. probably be. Hey, know. I don't know. We've coordinated this Diego. pretty quick. Brenda's like, I, I want to go to a strip club, but could we be done by nine? Dude, every That's fucking time. That's actually me. I think I'm more that person. Both you guys. I wanted to rant about this. Yeah, it's bad. It is the fucking hardest thing to fu- next to winning the lottery <laughs> to fucking <laughs> plan something with these two females right here. Every time. I Sorry. think I'm pretty good at it. Every I time like I, I have to work in the morning, so I can't make Brenda it. Works if it's not like one, it's the other. Oh, yeah. You know, it's always something specific. Like, even with this B&B, Marina texted me, and she's like, what kind of food are we going to be making? And I was like, I just wanted to Seriously? make sure. No, she said, what kind of meats in the tacos? Well, my friend here doesn't oh. eat carne asada, so I was just making sure you guys, I didn't know if you guys thought of that, so I just wanted to make sure. Why don't sure you eat that carne asada? Is it? Oh, He's Ramadan. pork. <laughs> <laughs> That's a whole different yeah, thing. Yeah, Ramadan. <laughs> See, this is what happens when you start intermingling the races. Yeah, it's just <clears throat> nobody can agree on anything. It's best to just keep them. Just eat, you know. Me, I mean, yeah, I give up something for Lance, but that's my religion, and that's real. <laughs> <laughs> What'd you give up for Lance? Um, 
I gave up the cross because I didn't do it. <laughs> <laughs> you gave up the good Lord's word. <laughs> good well, why don't you eat meat? Um, you I don't just, like it? I just gave it up like three years ago. No, I like it. It just it's not necessary. Wait, any live, so. you don't eat like red meat? Uh, yeah, just beef and pork. Oh. I mean, like no beef and pork. I eat chicken, turkey, and seafood. Well, you would have been able to eat the cilantro and tortillas. <laughs> so that was no, that was the no, only we reason had, I we had rice and beans. Yeah. yeah, okay, that kind of makes sense. I wasn't like trying to be picky. I just wanted to like make sure my friend was going to be able to eat something, yeah. or did we have to plan ahead and eat something? You know what I mean? Like, well, good thing they didn't because. At the end of the day, they didn't come. They didn't fucking end up coming. How did you I get had pink, pink eye? eye? How did you get pink eye? Someone fart in your face? That's what I'm <laughs> thinking. That's the first thing I think of every time. Okay, and okay. <laughs> every me time. Too, I don't know how you actually get pink eye. I told people that at <laughs> my e. work. Coli, I said, right? my cousin probably farted on my pillow because my cousin literally slept over at my house like Saturday. And Emily? I, yeah, and I woke up Monday with pink eye. Emily's like 25 years old, <laughs> for the record. <laughs> <laughs> what does that have to do with anything? Yeah. Well, I mean, because I feel like people are assuming it's a little kid. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh. Anyways, um, and I told people that at my work, I was like, I don't know, someone probably farted on my pillow, and they're like, what? And I was like, oh no, that's just like something people say. <laughs> yeah. And everyone was confused. I, was I like, told a group of like slightly older people that, and they're like, what are you talking about? I yeah. Like, is that Did like you not hear that as a kid? Yeah. No, Did you not have a childhood? Um, but what I think had happened was I went to the gym on Monday yeah. and, you know, I have eyelash extensions. So at w- I remember. Couldn't even notice. I need <laughs> a fill. Don't, don't, don't. Do th- no, I'm just kidding. Um, and so I went to the gym on last Monday and I remember there was an eyelash like in my eye. One of them like came off and uh, was floating in there. And that's like uh, one of the worst pains ever. Uh, so I. Is went it worse when it's fake? Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Because it's, like, a little hard on the end. So I went to the mirror, and I, like, fished it out with my dirty hand. God damn. From the gym, too. In the middle of a set, yeah. Oh, you're at the gym. I was at the gym whenever it happened. And then I went home. I took a nap. So Well, I took a shower and then took a nap. And so I think, like, I had it closed for a long period of time, too. And then the next day I woke up, and it was, like, no, I didn't. I had, like, a really bad fever. I felt like I was getting sick. Oh, wow. And then... Literally that night, my eye got gooey, <coughs> and I was like, "Great, I think I have pink eye." And it was heck of like tender. Mm-hmm. And then I went to sleep, and then I w- like not to sleep, but you know, like to lay down and go to sleep. Mm-hmm. And then I got up because there was an eyelash in my eye. Again? It's like, well, so I got up, I went to the mirror. It wasn't like it was just hanging in there. It wasn't actually in there. And I was like, "This is the same eye that this happened to me at the gym, and I did the same thing I'm doing right now." And it just made me think like that's probably how I got it. Uh, so you think yeah. it was just like irritated instead instead of pink dirty eye. hands in my eye? Yeah. So you could have went. Damn. Huh? So you could have <laughs> went. I had pink eye. I needed antibiotics, and you know how contagious that is. Oh, and then it started spreading to the other eye. So. Oh shit. That's why I didn't go. That's scary, right? Because like literally. Why are you like- <laughs> it was like Saturday morning and this eye was like crusted shut whenever I woke up. So I was like, I it fucking spread to the other eye. Damn. I remember one time my friend from like when I was younger, his name was Joe. He was an OG. Joe Mama. <laughs> 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 he uh, farted in my face one time when I, I, I was asleep and I woke up. I was like, <laughs> I was like, ah. <laughs> no way. Yeah. Damn. We were young yet. Yeah, you didn't get it though? Disgusting. No. You know, I was scared pink. though. I think I was scared. I was like, oh my God, I'm going to get eye. Have you ever had pink eye? I don't think so. I don't know. Like I feel like how did you, you ever have lice? Any of you guys? I don't think so. I did not. I did. You did? Isn't that like actual like bugs? Like actual little yeah. bugs? Yeah. Damn. So if you pick them, you see them, right? Yeah. And I like hear whenever little. you have to like pinch them really hard out. And if you <sighs> you have to squeeze it and you'll hear it pop and you'll know it's really like. Yeah, like that but that's just what my mom said. <laughs> I don't know if that's true. No. <laughs> I mean, you like pop them on the table or something. Or yeah. Because that, that, shit, that shit would hurt. Because my mom would run after me. She'd be like, get over here. Like, we have to get the piojos out. I would hide under the bed. Because <laughs> you sit there Sorry, and they poke. Sorry, can you speak English? I don't really. Piojos is lice. They, <laughs> I'm just kidding. No. They poke through your head. Like, show, you'll Pew? sit there. And, like, they literally, like, she'll, like, pull them out. With, like, and tweezers, then, huh? No, with, no, with your fingers. fingers. Wow. Oh, shit. How big are they? Like They're tiny. They're like, <laughs> How big are they? They're, like, the How big fleas. is enough? <laughs> They're, like, please. Tell me when to stop. So this is, like, eight inches, right? <laughs> Something. <laughs> hey, I saw this girl. <laughs> totally different story. You know what time? I saw this girl on TikTok, and she like pulled out a ruler, and she was like, "Be honest, is this really what you want?" And she went like, "I don't remember how the length." And yeah, you don't need like, too much. Wow. I mean, six inches is big if you really look at it. If you really you look know? at it on a ruler, <laughs> <laughs> right? This is funny because one time somebody agreed. <laughs> one time we were talking. We were, <laughs> one time we were talking with um, my friend Isaura. We were just hanging out. I think we were talking about penises. 
and I think we're talking about inches and like how big they actually were and stuff. And then I think Issa was like, how big is five inches? You know, and Hammy's like, well, five or no, she's like, how big is six? He's like, well, five is like, <laughs> he started like perfectly measuring on his hand. And then we all started dying. When I was younger, you know, you would measure it with your hand yeah. and then you'd go to ruler and then you would measure it from ruler to hand. Just to reference, like quick yeah. reference. And you're like, okay, this is this and this is this. You're in the club, you're like, hey. <laughs> hey, uh, can you fit this in your mouth? No. <laughs> God. Sorry. Oh, wow. That You're works. sick. Jesus. You're sick. We have ladies present. No, we yes. are a lady. We're all ladies here. I, is, I never had lice growing up, but I remember like... Oh, when they would come to your class and like dig through your hair in the middle of class? Yeah. yeah. That was my favorite. <laughs> that happened to you? Like, ah, a little massage in the middle of third grade. Yeah. monkeys? That never happened to you guys? figures after... <laughs> No, you guys didn't happen to you guys. Well, yeah, they no, didn't. but I remember like <laughs> I used to be at a daycare for a little bit. And, like my mom would drop me off. And I remember they were talking about like when they dropped me off, they're like, okay, we got lice. Like a couple, <laughs> some of the kids have them, you know? <laughs> and then I remember they were like fucking digging through their heads and I remember being scared as shit. And I didn't I get used it. to love it. They would come to like our classrooms and just go through like, everyone's. Fuck. <laughs> with like little. Right it was like chopsticks, <laughs> I swear. <laughs> they were just like digging through it. Okay, you're good. And then the people that had it, they would just send them. Marina out putting white ants on her fucking head so they could still pick through them. Damn. <laughs> I, I remember I, I was like in preschool and that's where I, I think that's where I got it. Cause I remember they, somebody else gave it to me. Hey, it wasn't me. It wasn't me. It has yeah. to start somewhere. Yeah. Um, and I remember they put it in tape, like in two tabs of tape so they could show my mom. Oh shit. Yeah. And I was like, it was just, I remember it was preschool. I remember that classroom. Like it's the, like the Han Solo. When it's like <laughs> and the carbonite. Yeah. Like, <laughs> Sorry. Wait, so did your Crazy. siblings get it? Because you have siblings. Jackie got it. My brothers didn't get it. Oh, that's good. But you, I don't even remember. I don't even know. But it was pretty cool. So like, what? How do you guys get rid of it? Like, take it out and then wash your hair a couple times, or what? Um, there's treatment. It's like fucking flea. Fl- like don't the they say flea you can put shampoo. mayonnaise? Like flea <laughs> shampoo that you could put <laughs> or peanut what? butter mayonnaise. I heard it like. Oh yeah, you can put mayonnaise to like try to like drown them out. But that shit, I don't. Do you guys like peanut butter? Yeah, I Is do. Is it a liquid? Oh, you see that one? <laughs> Um, hey, um, I have a <laughs> question. <laughs> I yes? have a question. <laughs> Would you rather, <laughs> um, gay son or thought daughter? <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Brenda, oh, okay. Sorry. I asked Serena the other day. Would you rather um sit on cake and eat dick or eat dick and? S- oh wait, I said it again. Let's say wait. Okay, sit on the cake and eat dick, or sit eat on cake. a dick. And, and eat cake. Sit on a dick. By eat, do you mean suck or do you mean literally a eat a penis? You're saying a lot of eating dick. Like you, have, you repeated yourself eat. twice again. Like fucking, I don't know, suck Are dick. Are you sucking it or eating it? It's probably sucking it. So you're sucking know, the dick. And but sitting on a cake. you're sitting on it, you're getting fucked. No, no, no. What? Would you rather <laughs> sit on a cake and suck a dick or would you rather sit on a dick and eat a cake? But is, is the, the dick penis inside, inside, inside of me? Yeah. Yeah, that's why you're sitting you're on sitting it. sitting on it. We need to be more vulgar here, okay? I need specificity. It's going in. Oh, I, I'll I'd suck, suck a dick. the dick. Yeah, I'll yeah, suck, a dick. suck it. I'd suck it. So and sit on the cake. <laughs> I'd suck it, then eat the cake after. <laughs> no, you're, you're sweet. Eating, yeah, oh, you're gonna the cake and you're eat, gonna eat the cake you after you sit on it. How Republicans suck. <laughs> <laughs> They're Republicans. I learned a few things at church camp growing up. <laughs> okay, <laughs> well, those golf lessons weren't for free. <laughs> <laughs> what would you what guys? You're not funny. Do you think you'd be good at sucking? Give it one minute. You'll laugh real quick. Um, I think. I'd get, but yeah, maybe probably. I think that we think we'd be good at it, but I think once you start doing it, you'd be like, I just haven't even practiced. Like, yeah. I don't even know how tired you get. Well, like, what would your strategy be? Can you move your foot from my straw? Straw? My straw. Oh shit. <laughs> <laughs> oh shit. <laughs> Drink, <laughs> drinking <laughs> your foot. I'm like, oh, that was scratching my <laughs> heel. <laughs> You didn't actually touch it, but it's it? all flaky in there. <laughs> Ew. Ew, yeah. You're sick. Well, strategy, well, depending on the size. You know, it's crazy when I see people jerk off and they're like this. Oh, like There's when they're blowing them like that? Yeah, that they do the one. Oh, you per- porn, okay? <laughs> Some of us are sinful. You know. Um, we can't be good you know, all We the can't time. relate to you fucking addicts. <laughs> yeah, that's bad. Okay, well. Yeah, we know. Six months, okay. <laughs> um... Six months. I think I would go one hand and just, you know, the old twist the boot. Are you going boot. consistent the whole time or are you like sucking the balls? <laughs> are you deep throating? 
I would. I would. I'd rather not deep throw. Maybe like once or twice, and then I'd be like, you know, it's good enough. That's all. It you seems get. like you hell. Know, that's a weird. Sorry, I don't know. If you guys don't know, but like when they like <laughs> put the like against the cheek and like, you know. Yeah, it's like, but they're not like popping it. Up. I guess yeah, it's just like right it, there. But they're just jamming it into the cheek. I wonder if it's like when your penis is like bulged against your pants and you're like. Yeah. I think you kind of just, yeah. Mm. I got to switch the topics. Anyways. Yeah, anyways. <laughs> what would you guys rather do for this <laughs> cake? So confused. Oh. Um, I probably would rather sit on a dick and eat cake. Yeah. More natural. Hey. Yeah. Uh, Why would I sit you, on a cake? You'd rather. S- but what's. It just seems like a lot more effort than just like, like a nice up. little snack. But she doesn't have to ride it. She just sits on it. Oh, you just stand like. Mm. And then you just get hey. up. Whatever works. You just eat cake. While <laughs> someone eat cake. Whatever the scenario cake. is. Like little snack. While someone's like, digging for lice. Ha- <laughs> oh, perfect world right there. <laughs> <laughs> what more could you want? You're just going to make a fucking Tinder. The bio's going to be like, <laughs> must look for lice. <laughs> <laughs> must help me look for lice. <laughs> First date. Hey, help First me help you. Do you. Help me. Do you guys think um, nipple hair is gross on men? Mm. Be careful. I wouldn't. I wouldn't know. I feel like, yeah, I've never really thought of that. I mean, not really. Mm. You know what kind of grosses me out, though? I get a little bit, like... Like, hairy-ass, long armpit hair. Mm. That does, I'm like... <laughs> like t- <laughs> I apologize if anyone watching never, has that. I, I don't know. know. Hey, I'm just thinking of it, like, being sweaty in the summer, yeah. and that just, like, is a hot Fuck mess me, to right? me. You know what used to gross me out for the longest time is just beard hair, like men's beard hair. I just think it's disgusting. <laughs> but to like touch, hey, like that's right fine to look at, but I don't want to touch it. Touching it just seems so disgusting. <laughs> and every time you do it, I'm like fucking so grossed out. Hey, have you ever given anyone the a rash? Heard. <laughs> like on their face because of your beard? No. Like the a next rash. day, it's like all fucking red right here. Actually, I'm I have, a, not like I have a friend. <laughs> um, <laughs> he gets rashes. I have a friend that that's happened to her. Like she literally like broke out all on her chin oh, and shit. was like hella red and Ugh. inflamed but she has a really sensitive face yeah mm. yeah, yeah no i don't think i've ever seen that i've never even heard of that we played suck and blow at the bnb hey you, who'd you kiss i kissed Jaime. <laughs> did you really <laughs> yeah. and, and angel shocker I and kiss angel. angel you guys kiss angel on the lips just like a quick i kissed um, the game yeah it's like it's with the point. card and then if the card falls oh no yeah i know i'm just surprised smidge. they you guys kissed angel i kissed a girl Oh, oh yeah. yeah. Who'd you guess? Yeah. In suck and blow or just like there? No, suck and blow. <laughs> oh, right. Who'd you guess? Uh, I know her. Hey. Did you say your name? Yeah, maybe we should bleep it out. We'll bleep it. We'll bleep, we'll bleep it. it. But she's cool. She's yeah. a Shovel. Hummy. She's the homie. Hey, it's cool that we're on the hot here. tub playing it. There's like fucking ten of us in the hot tub. It was overfilling. It was hey, and why was there a video of you and Hyman? You guys were too close in the hot tub, and no one else was in the hot that tub. That was when we were playing suck and blow. I think. No, no, no. The hot, the tub, hot tub was tub like it was really jerk and no. The hot tub was like completely <laughs> empty. <laughs> and really? You and Hyman were just in a quarter, and then Isawa was like sitting on the edge, and Maybe she didn't want to get in. Oh yeah, I left right when everyone else left. This Maybe like the beginning. Right in the beginning. It was dark outside. I heard you fell asleep at 10. <laughs> Did Bro, you? 10 felt like 2. Okay, just to, for context, we got an Airbnb for our friend Noel's birthday. Uh, there was hey. like fucking 14 people there. They were supposed to come, but they both got sick. Uh, Pink you know. eye. <laughs> but uh, yeah, and at the last Airbnb, which we did in like November, <laughs> it was for <laughs> me and Jaime's birthdays. And Jaime fell asleep at like 11 p.m. there. And everybody was just partying for like so long after. And he was just knocked out. And it was just, like, weeks and weeks of, like, preparation and just getting it all, like, settled, getting everybody to agree on a price and a place and all this. And he did the same thing this time. Like, so much preparation for a place, the pricing, you know. He handled everything. All yeah, the guests, I really did everything. Everything. <laughs> like, so much work just to go to sleep at 10. Did you really, Jaime? I, did anyone draw a dick on like your face? Did you feel, like, robbed? Like, it was a waste of your time Not as money? much as last one. Because I feel we started early. I feel, I don't know. I just feel like we did a lot. Didn't th- wasn't checking at 4 p.m. Bitch. <laughs> 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 you have shit in your mustache. Dude, it's so gross. That happens all the time when we're eating and I just see like... It's always like <laughs> drop like beads of liquid yeah, like, like, right stuck there. in there. I'm like, Dude, when uh, I had my beard That's thick, how I picture that was the hairy worst. armpits when the, in the summer Dude, sweat. I didn't shave my armpits <laughs> until... <laughs> Ooh, I didn't trim... the heebie-jeebies. <laughs> Let's see what we're working with here. We can't. You know it. Make sure the camera can see. I uh, oh. see. It, I feel like it. <laughs> it's pretty hairy, or is that? That's I'm not bad, right? That's no, hairy. it's pretty hairy. That's like pushing it. It's like pushing pee. 
Let me Push fucking it. put mine out too. Chris's is blonde. Uh, Chris, yours isn't gonna come off. Yeah, <laughs> off. I, I can't. I can't. Do you show your hair <laughs> nipples? Nipples. Dude, mine are like that. I used to worse, trim them all the time. These are curly, huh? Yeah. But I just don't shave as much just anymore. Just one. They haven't seen them. I didn't trim my armpit hair. Do you trim yours, Jaime? No. Okay, I didn't trim my armpit hair until I was like 20 years old. And it wasn't until I was, you know, making out with this girl in the back of my Nissan Sentra. Hey. <laughs> and my Where dreams go. Where <laughs> <laughs> dreams are made. <laughs> and I took off my shirt and she was like, I've never seen armpit hair like that. What? And like, my armpit hair is straight. Like, it's not curly like that. It's literally just like, <laughs> like it sticks straight out. And she was just so like fixated on it for like 20 minutes. She was like, dude, I just can't. Like, <laughs> I can't get over that. Like, it's just so straight and long. And then I shaved it later. And she's like, <laughs> she's like, that's so much better. I didn't oh shave God. it off, but I like trimmed it pretty short, you know? Yeah, and ever uh, since then, you've been cutting it? Eh, a few times a year, you know? Like, I, I don't shave it every time I shave my, you know, pubic hair. I try to trim my nips, though, every time I do my pubic hair. You should get little scissors. And then I can never. face razors? Yeah, like I, need to, I need to get a new, because I had like, the Manscaped lawnmower. I don't know if you guys ever see that because you're not men, but, like, there's ads everywhere for that thing and it's like a special razor that doesn't like cut you down oh, there okay. so i've been using like a fucking you know coles razor and it cuts me so bad it's terrible you use the same razor for your pubes and your face and your armpit yeah <laughs> well, that's right <laughs> do you do that too don't you? No. all at the same time Bitch. you use three in one shampoo well, do I, don't you use, I don't use any shampoo do you guys have separate ones for your like beard <laughs> <laughs> Do you guys get waxed or do you shave your face? Or do you not do anything to it? I have those it? little tiny face razors. I don't know if you know what I'm talking That's about. That's what I use for my beard. Like the microblading. Yeah, and then I just With have the to like, do my little what? mustache. No. That's threading. Oh. Oops. Do you guys, uh, what about for your eyebrows? Pluck them? No, you get them threaded. I do the same thing with a little face razor. Wait, Brenda, have you been getting wax still? Can we talk about that? I could talk about that. <laughs> go, go first, Martina, and then you warm her up. Yes. <laughs> That's the answer. How's the, well, the experience? experience? Oh, okay. So God it's pretty it. crazy because, like, right when you get there, she just says, "Okay, take your pants off," and it's like, "No, no, no like, she doesn't even say that." <laughs> I've done months. Hey, hey, she <laughs> no. <laughs> no, she doesn't even say that. She says, "Okay, you can get undressed." And the first time I went, I was like, "Oh my God!" Imagine I start taking my shirt off too. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Does she just uh, turn around when you get undressed? She's like, like mixing wax and stuff. Uh, so, uh, you, you know, you just take off your pants and then you just pop right on the bed. And then she's like, okay, butterfly. And then you. What does that mean? You like put your legs together and then you put them as close. You're laying on your back? Grab my my mic, please, comrade. All right. Center this. Oh, shit. Okay. Oh, my God. Brenda's naked right now. (laughs) (laughs) You guys can't see it. You just put a sticker on my vagina because I don't, you know, want anybody to see it. Like people look in there. (laughs) You just lay on your back and then you like put your legs like this. And you put your heels like as close to your butt that you can get. Mm -hmm. Uh huh. Um, oh, because she sits right there, so she doesn't. She's not sitting. She's she standing. Stands. Like and you could just feel the wind, like on your asshole and everything. Oh, yeah. there's a little fan blowing too. Really? And then when mm-hmm. she gets to your like butt crack, okay. you have to like knees grab to your chest. knees and you like put them on your fucking chest, and your like asshole is like out. Yeah. And but the wax is a little warm, and she just like, Ooh. and then she just yeah. It's crazy. Uh, does it hurt? Uh, um, I think it just depends. Like Terrible. I feel like, oh, wow, <laughs> <laughs> I feel like um. To me, it's like a pain level of like three or four. And yeah. Brenda says like, oh my God, that hurts so much. So I'm like, I think we just have different. It's th- for me, it's like the <laughs> asshole. No, the asshole doesn't hurt at all. We should do it live on the pod. I'll do it. I think we can, but I'm t- I just think of the <laughs> I'll I'll do do it. Fucking I was oh, like, yeah, that sounds like a lot of editing. editing. You just watch. But the can asshole. I, can I wax your asshole? If you want. Yeah, I would do Would it. you actually do that, yeah. though? No, I would literally I wax, would wax my asshole. Yeah, I would touch you your ass. You just see my balls and penis and <laughs> Hey, if you're fine with it, I'm fine with it. I'm cool with One that. One thing about Chris, <laughs> I think when oh. I first, like, okay. met, when I first, like, met you, I was like, he's so cool. Like, he's not like the average Joe. Like, some guys are so, like... They just don't like talking about certain subjects and they're so closed off to like Mm -hmm. speaking about certain things. And you're so open and like, like when I first met you, I was like, wow, he's so cool. Like I've never like, (laughs) you just feel so comfortable with him. Like he's like, I don't know. I don't know. You just say, you just have to meet him. (laughs) (laughs) And if you don't, you're not, you're not one of God's favorites. Was that your experience? 
Everybody just say good things about me right now. Like with you, I don't know. I don't really remember how me and you yeah, became friends. I just remember either. you were new at work, and I just kept calling you. Oh, Christoph. you called me Christoph. And yeah, then everybody would Frozen call me was always playing. Yeah. And so I just yeah, and I feel like you were shy at first. Yeah, I was. And I was just like, I'm. I feel like when people are shy around me, like it makes me nervous. So I just am an open book, and I just start talking, mm. and I don't shut up. And yeah. then people are probably like, "What is wrong with this girl?" But then I feel like it makes them also like open up faster. So I feel like yeah. me and you clicked really quick. Dude, I sense. feel like I'm so shy and just awkward. Like until you get to know me, you then are. I'm like I'm fine. Yeah, but I'm, I'm like really I'm awkward, way. you know. And every day I think about it, and I'm like insecure about it. And I just feel like, like at work especially, because I've been working there for like three or four months, and I'm still like, I'll talk to you if you talk to me, but I'm just awkward as fuck, you know? Like, oh, I can yeah. just say dumb shit, and it's like a movie, you know? Yeah. Where like their crush comes up, and they like say the stupidest shit, and they're like, why did I say that? That's me, like all the time. <laughs> Don't you hate when you guys are walking, and then you guys are thinking of how you're walking, and you kind of walk a little <laughs> funny? I feel like know? I've never thought about how I walk, well, I but now I'm going to start doing that. I'm I do sometimes. Feel very like, if usually it's either at the mall. Because <laughs> there's just so many people. Oh my god, you know? I hate going to the mall. I hate it too. It's so much anxiety. Yeah, I, <sighs> yes, thank you. And then you. you see hella people you know. Oh, I'm not that popular. <laughs> That's the fun part. I never not like that unless I wasn't prepared. There's this uh, there's this guy in Modesto that me and Jaime refer to as the plague. Oh shit. He he has banged every mildly attractive woman in Modesto. Like I swear to God. We'll send a girl to the group chat, just like, oh, she's banging, you know, or like, wow, she's looking good. And then someone we know who is, knows this guy is like, oh, he fucked her. <laughs> I'm like, seriously? Yeah. So we started calling him the plague because he bangs every fucking woman in Modesto. Hey, he hasn't got a And I though. found out. Yeah. I found out the other day. What does he look like? He banged my ex-girlfriend. <gasps> Not my most recent ex Oh, oh my God. My <laughs> heart. My heart is sank. My girlfriend from sixth grade. Oh, my. Oh, oh my god. Get over it. Is that even, <laughs> no. is that even your ex-girlfriend? Come on. Yeah, I know. It's just some girl oh, you probably gave a little quick speech to. Her name's the... Uh, oh, I want to show her, but I fucking don't have my phone. Can I see your phone? Yeah. She might be private. We'll block this for a second. No, fuck or, it. Or you, okay, you just keep, keep going. She was my girlfriend for oh, sixth grade. Dude, she's a goth baddie. She's so Jeez. fucking... Oh, I think a she's so banging. goth baddie? Let me see what I searched up. Hold on. Yeah, and then uh, the person who knows this guy... <laughs> And uh, uh, we heard that he watches the podcast. I don't know how much he watches it, but we heard that he watches it. So that's kind of fucking wild, you know, if he's listening. Hey. Some context clues here, you know. Sorry. Here she is. I didn't go to Fuck, meetings. she's private. That's all right. We Anyways. can see her little. Yeah. Can, can you click on her profile? She's just a oh, goth no, baddie. And I'm just like, I would just love you for you to, to like dom me in a Wendy's parking lot. Wow. What'd you say? She's nice, right? She's cute. There's she's much like a like teacher vibes. Oh, I don't know what you said. <laughs> what about the Wendy's parking lot? <laughs> they fucked at a Wendy's parking lot? I in wish. sixth grade? Would. Oh. Careful with the no, camera. No, we kissed though, which was cool. Oh. I had two girlfriends in sixth grade. Mm. And I remember thinking like, damn, at this rate, like I'm going to be a fucking player, <laughs> you know? Yeah. And then I didn't have another girlfriend until oh, 2000. Hey, I was going to say, <laughs> hey, I was going to say, Chris, you follow her. How how do you not? But I forgot this is Brenda's Yeah. Story. Oh, so you follow her now? Yeah. Have you ever said anything to her? Uh. She followed me like a few years ago, and I think, I think she'll slide up on my story maybe like every once in a while, or maybe was just she a few goth times, baddie in sixth grade as well, or is she no? Like she was just a baddie baddie. Hey. She did that thing where you like. <laughs> Do you think sixth graders are baddies? I love well, the time. when you're in sixth grade, you probably think sixth graders are baddies. <laughs> and she would do the thing where you uh, teasing, teasing your hair, like and her hair would be so poofy because she was still kind of like gothic ish, but like. Not like that, because now she's like fucking all black, like chains and like oh my God, eyebrows, yeah. like super thin. You know, I'm giving so much God. context here. <laughs> Jesus, I fucking love <laughs> hey, you it. You might though. as well put her at right here. I know, but <laughs> yeah, she had like poofy ass, like teased hair, and I was like, Dude, that's so hot. Is she Latina? <laughs> hey, hey, me. Where'd you go I to middle think, school? No, I'm, I'm not sure. Hmm. We'll bleep it, but her name. She's just. That's what I called her when we were, you know. Call her baby. Hey, day. Oh yeah. <laughs> God damn. What do you guys call your significant others? I mean. I well, don't Brenda. have a significant oh, other. Brenda had a little ting. Oh, oh, my God. God. Stop. Oh, my God. I told you not to fucking Spell. say anything, hey, Becky. Hey, that was the Spell. one oh. thing. That was the one <laughs> thing Tell I said not to disclose, but. No, Chris, I'm, I'm not telling you shit anymore. <laughs> what? Hey, we're, we're you can't just go and fucking fine. expose me if for everyone to see. Yes, we can. It wasn't anything serious. Nothing. Are you guys done, though? Yeah. 
Ah, oh, shit. Do you think he'll watch this? I just this? wasn't feeling it. No. He, like, unfollowed me. You thought I was me. feeling you? Hey. That's not that much. I was. Um, the first time was like I cut him off, he like unfollowed me on everything and like blocked me. Shit. Yeah. And Shit. then like so after that, well, would you like not? Like after that, he just didn't follow me back on anything, so it was just through message. Yeah. But um, no, yeah, I cut it off again because I was like, I'm just not feeling it. Like I've tried this so many times, and yeah. I was like, I'm just like we're not clicking. Like I'm yeah. not excited to text you. Like you know what I'm doing? I'm That's doing weird. this because yeah. like. I want to try, you know what I mean? But it wasn't like anything like serious. I think so since, gonna get married since you've sure. done the cutting off this time, have you had any thoughts? Like, I'm going to reach out. <laughs> I'm going to reach out. I'm like, oh. I get back with him or anything like that. Any oh, urges? No, just A little late to, night, you hey. know? Hey, 2 a.m. <laughs> shit. Seven hours, seven hours after nine. It's getting warm, guys. We're almost there. Yeah. <laughs> hey, hey. It's happened three times, so. Shit. Lots of fun. I just be like, damn. Who am I going to talk to right now? Jaime. Oh. Jaime doesn't want to talk to me anymore. I don't know why, but. I'd be asleep and be like. <laughs> hey, Jaime goes to sleep at 10, baby girl. Yeah, hey, me too, Jaime. I just want to talk at 9. Can I call you? <laughs> Jaime, I, not the camera, like, girl. <laughs> not the camera. Hey, Jaime's like, you're scared oh, off the hose. Time, I just want to talk about my day. Mm. Yeah, I'm chill. <laughs> you're going to be like, I got $7 from the tax return. Like, <laughs> <laughs> no, it wasn't anything serious. Chris. Did you guys. Did you guys kiss? I'm sorry. Huh? Did you get your first kiss? Oh, uh, okay. Hey, I'm way past that. I'm way past that. Come yeah. on. Yeah, like that was still two years ago. <laughs> that was so last so Thursday. So last week. How how old were you guys with your first like real kiss? Like not the kid kiss. Um, eighth grade. Thirteen. Wow. Thirteen. Damn. I'm like six. What were you doing in fucking Shit. fourth grade? Shit. Fourth grade. Oh. <laughs> yeah, I'm just kidding. I was in sixth That's grade as well. Sheesh. I remember Jared Thatcher pressured me to do it. Do you know Jared Thatcher? <laughs> do you know Jared Thatcher? Jared Thatcher? No. He, <laughs> I went to high school with Derek him. Jeter? I kissed Brittany Moe. <laughs> Buster Posey? <What? laughs> you kissed Buster Posey? <laughs> Did he retire? <laughs> Damn, RIP. RIP the goat. He didn't die. Well, he's dead to the sport. <laughs> oh, yeah. wow. Um, you know what's crazy is... um. <laughs> everybody loves okay. everybody who meets Brenda fucking loves her like Lindsay's yeah. met you one time I'm sure I could say the same about you Marina if you've met like these people but I don't you think haven't. you've met many of our like newer friends but Mm-mm. Lindsay met Brenda like we just hung out one night and dude every time we're together she's like dude I fucking love Brenda she was like I fucking love her like I would kiss her oh wow <laughs> and like then she, I would kiss her too she, she, dude, she when she, yeah when she heard you guys weren't coming to the B&B she's like dude I'm so pissed she's like take me <laughs> home you know you and then same, the with, <laughs> same with same with Isauda she was Lindsay. like dude I want to fucking meet her so bad like yeah you're just very likable no, yeah, like, you. think of me as a person. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> but <laughs> remember, like, all of those people that worked at Kohl's and were, like, Brenda's friends? Uh-huh. And I didn't... Yeah, I really loved her. And out of all of those people that worked there, who was the one that, like, kind of clicked with... Tony you know liked me? me. I only really liked... I mean, no shade to any of those people, but, like, the one I clicked to was Brenda. The other people, I was like... Yeah. But, like, you, Nish, yeah. Nish would tell me that, too. Like, he's, like... He goes, we don't really let. He goes, it's not like we don't let people in, like, to our little mm-hmm. group. Like, he we, goes, you just kind of, like. She just kind of. Nobody comes in that fast. I'm like a fucking you know? leech. Yeah, yeah she's like, like a, like a like, chihuahua yeah. biting her ankles. Like, <laughs> fuck, okay, get in. Like, yeah, Nish would always be like, look at you. You're hanging out, like, at parties with us. Like, you get invited. So like, we're all hella old. Yeah, yeah. yeah. We're all hella like older t- than her. I'm only 20, and they're all over, like. We were starting to be friends with Brenda when she was 18. Yeah, that's wild. So that's what I mean. Like, she was very likable. How does it Thank feel you. to still not like be able to go to the club with them when they go? I feel like I get fo- I get a little FOMO, but I'm yeah. not like I'm like my time will come. I'm, like, I'm not like crying about it. How come? Like, but never... they look like they have hella fun. Yeah. Like her and Emily. How come we've never been clubbing together? I know. Let's go. Yeah. Cause oh, do we go to Mag- Let's go to Mangos. Let's do it. Whenever Jaime because wants to go, you don't want to go. I know. Whenever and then the whenever club. we wanted to go, Jaime didn't have an ID. <gasps> that is true. That is true. Yeah. Yeah. Let's go soon, guys. I have I need a question. To get I'm this down. out of my system. Yeah, he wants to go. We've never been. Wait, really. you've never. Oh, you. I've been to, to Mango with Mango right? one Once. time, and I Once. don't want to go to Mangoes, but it's only because I didn't I drink. I was fucking. I know. Go to a real club. That's like one thing is like um. a little kid shit. Right now. <laughs> what am I gonna get a half with a meal? With the big old X's on her hands. <laughs> yeah. I do get X's. Oh, these are drinks. They're huge. I'm a swig, dude. Fuck you. They're from corner to corner. I literally put shots. 
I put little <laughs> bottles of vodka in my boobs. Do you guys want a video of that? I have a video of that. Yeah. Or not. Of her boobs? Yeah. Um, she well, just no, tucked I, them under. I just like took it dude, out. Dude, you should do it. And then like where the pointy like, cap is like your nips. It's All like right. super powerful. And dude. you know what? She got pulled back a little bit. Yeah. Like, the we metal detector security, like literally. Like, oh, like, they made her. me like put my hands up and wand me and then yeah. turn around wand me. And then I went through again and I beeped again. But I don't think it might have been my jewelry because why would like shots be tearing it's, it's, it's like thrill. aluminum cap that's yeah it, right? probably the cap uh, i was maybe. buzzing she gave me it was like two little ones yeah two or three mm-hmm. but i don't think i wanted to do the third one so i was like I'm i think you drank it. one like over vodka or something you drank one there at the airbnb and then we stayed at the, the same airbnb the, like, yeah. yeah they went to the one that we went to for uh, your first, birthday the first time. i know we have to be in we went to the no way we're clubbing and then going back home like at 2 a.m yeah it's from sacramento yeah you just kind of we walk like oh my god it was so fun it was so close it's so close to make walking like through it town it took like two minutes i swear it is so fun and there's like hella people outside yeah. there's so many lights he's like downtown sacramento it was just heck of vibey huh? it was just so and then some it guy was it was so funny he was like we'll give you a ride and yeah, there's like, me emily no me emily isabel brenda smoke? right so four of us smoke? in like a three-seater truck and then we were like how are we all gonna fit in there and then he was like it will fit and we're like, no. <laughs> yeah, yeah it was so funny you know what i was thinking me and Jaime are pretty good guys, you know. <laughs> I don't think menaces. we're the best guys, but yeah, I think more wholesome people. Yeah, genuinely, we're pretty decent men, you know. And I was just thinking, like, you know, how much excitement and shit we're probably gonna miss out on in life just because we're like good guys. Like, we're never gonna be like the toxic ex who's like, "Fucking, I'm outside your house and I'm not leaving." You that's know, that's just weird, though. Yeah, that's like, thrilling. Yeah, it's a thrill. <laughs> Who's that you thrilling know? for? It's like a hunt. That's thrilling for you because you're traumatizing the girl inside. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so like, I don't think you, know, you can do that. You know, I don't think that's You'll never like follow a girl home from the club. And that's be like, weird. That, no, that's weird know? energy. That. Please don't do that. Hey, what the fuck? There's not even good points here. <laughs> I can't think of more kids. It's just a fucking <laughs> gag. Who do you okay? want to be as I thought a man? you guys would go along. Oh. <laughs> Jesus. Oh. God damn. A couple of blondes over here. Hey, yeah. I'm just saying. I'm but little... like, are you being serious about like, because you guys don't like wild out? So. No, but we were no. talking about how well. we are way more timid. Yes. And like, we don't have. Oh, you guys overthink. Huh? I was here. Yes. Yeah, that too. That big one. It's just like, we don't do certain things that like other guys would just like. Do. Yeah, because I feel yeah. like a lot of shitty guys like. She's gonna say it, you know, like they they get a lot more like tail, you know, and they have more stories of like True. hooking up with girls. But then I feel like the girls are always like, oh, he's a fucking dick, or like True. I regret it, or whatever. No, yeah, they and are. I feel like, like we just don't shit. have those stories really. Where it's but like, I feel like a lot of girls are like naive in the sense of like, oh my god, this he's guy, so sweet, whatever. Yeah, so how, hey, and then them. like, yeah. you know what I mean? And then that's and why they get the tail. And then after they're like, I don't want you, or whatever. And then it's like, and then we we're gonna end up dating them when we're like thirty. And then they've just been through the ringer yeah, isn't that and what trauma. And we have to deal with like, no, all but like, like do you feel like since you're such a nice I'll guy that she's probably don't worry but if you're watching future wife, <laughs> <laughs> but like, do you feel like since you're a nice guy that you would find yourself to rather not rather, but like in a sense like be in a relationship over just like hooking up for a night. You know what I mean? Like, no. I feel like you're, you guys are the type years. of guys that would feel bad about like, you know what I mean? Like ghosting yeah, a girl definitely. for the next day. Oh yeah. I, I still think about some people that have ghosted. I'm like, I, that's the worst thing I've ever done. <laughs> but I'm thinking too, like just their personality trait, like their, uh, their, their personality. Sorry. Like the types of people that are like all crazy and, and yeah. whatever. And more like, you know, don't give a fuck. I feel like they just do more crazy ass fun shit. Yeah. Like, you know, like they'll write an ATV, like, and fall no, off yeah. and like hey, almost, almost break their neck and, and then do that fucking sick yeah <laughs> that <was a> crazy <laughs> like story damn you know <laughs> yeah. yeah man i don't know at the uh at the bnb right dude we got there at fucking 4 30 4 45 and we started drinking instantly god damn it <laughs> so you guys deal, does up. it actually because it's a wig so like in real life though it's not that bad right like no like you don't feel like you're constantly like heavy there's like, like this thing that people say is like how can you feel a single strand of hair on your arm ver- like you'll be like oh, get off of me versus like all the hair on your head laying on your shoulders you get like, used you to it huh it. yeah that's a little weird huh anyways we started drinking at like fucking right when we got there and then we just kept drinking until like midnight and i ended up PM. staying up until mm-hmm. like basically like four in the morning hey. and by that point because we like we did a fire outside some of us and we were just like sitting there chilling and i like sobered up like i went to bed sober i was just super tired you know and i fell asleep and then at like 6 a.m i woke up 
and I was like, I kind of feel like I need to throw up right now. Mm. And I was like, how does she go back to sleep? <laughs> <laughs> I woke up like a few minutes you later. Like, oh, oh, oh. <laughs> oh God, I was on my oh side. My God. Thank God. Oh good, yeah. Thank God. And I woke up a few minutes later. And I was like, ah, "Fuck, let me go to the bathroom." Mm. And I like, got up so like calmly, and I like put my hoodie on. I got my phone. I got my hydro flask, and I like walked to the bathroom. And I was like, once I got to the bathroom, I was like, I feel like I need to throw up and shit and pee at the same time. <laughs> I was like, fuck. And I was about to sit. And I like, pulled my pants down. I was like, wait. And I pulled nauseous? it back up. And then I fucking got down and just fucking threw up. Uh, it's crazy, too, because, like, after I, like, stopped drinking, but I was, like, still drunk, I had two bags of Hot Cheetos, small bags. Mm-hmm. And I kept having heartburn, mm. like, the whole rest of the night. I was like, god damn. Like, I just kept burping, having heartburn. And then when I threw up, it was, like, fucked. Yeah. Like, I was like, what did I eat that was red? I just <laughs> forgot that I ate the hot Cheetos. I was like, am I bleeding in my stomach? Like, what oh the my fuck? God. And then, ew, dude, it's fucked because, like, my whole throat was just, like, burning for, mm. like, even when I woke up in the morning, I was like, dude, my throat's still, like, from, like, the hot Cheetos and, like, fucking, uh, what's it called? Bat Heartburn, you know? <laughs> <coughs> and I was just like, did I throw up from the liquor or did I throw up from the hot Cheetos? You know? Because it was yeah. like, I had been sober for so long. Like, it's probably the liquor because yeah. that happens to me after going out. Mm-hmm. Like, I'll be fine. I'll go to sleep fine. And then I'll wake up in the morning. I'm like, I'm going to throw Ugh. up. And my mouth gets watery and I have to like sprint to the it's bathroom. Like, but I, I, every any time I've ever thrown up drinking, it was when I was like climax. Like, I'm at the peak and I'm like, oh my God. And then I throw up and then I pass out. Oh, you don't I wake up. up see, but I never really... Yeah, I don't... Or it's never like after I've done... After no, I'm see, sober, I'm always know? that way. Like, I'll really? throw up. I won't throw up that night. I'll throw up the next day. Interesting. I feel like the yeah. thing with Chris is when he used to drink heavily, he would drink heavily. Yeah. So that like he gets so fucked up that like before he even came down or anything, he's already like, yeah, just it's done. Yeah. But I think no, most normal people... Oh, no, because you know, you see a lot of people throwing <laughs> up at like... You know, in the club. Oh my gosh! No, my mom just told me this story about when her and her like best friend, (laughs) they would go out, and (laughs) it was so funny because I guess one time they were like at Palladium, I think, and Mm -hmm. they were sitting on like some couches, and then my mom's friend went threw up right there, and then she said, "I just threw up," (laughs) and then they just (laughs) got up and left. No. (laughs) And then they just like kept partying. (laughs) (laughs) No, literally, like her. And when they were telling me this story, they were like. I just threw up like the <laughs> eyes all wide and stuff. I was hecka cracking up. I was like, bleep. All right, bleep <laughs> um, that. Bleep that. She'll she'll be like, <laughs> sorry, editor. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I was like, you cannot hang. Have you guys thrown up anywhere that's not like a toilet and not outside, like somewhere bad? Mm, threw up on a carpet, like in my niece. I threw up in my cousin's like car. Damn, that's both bad. Is it? <laughs> it's crazy to me because it's like. When people go out to eat or to drink, you know, have a night out, like, at the bar or club, whatever, like, you get so, like, done up and you're so, like, fancy and shit, and then you just get to this point of, like, being so disgusting. Like, you throw up on yourself or, like, your fucking, like, titties are falling out and it's, oh, like, wow. you're just so, like, sloppy, like sloppy? Yeah. after being done up, like, so well, you know? No, yeah. <laughs> oh, my sister's giving up. And then what's so funny is that one time <laughs> my <laughs> friend was driving. <laughs> 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 hey <laughs> no we're still going but it's no you're okay it's do you like right. do you like the wigs <laughs> serving <laughs> <laughs> all right anyways what are you saying um my friend literally after a night out she was following me because i was driving my other friend's car home because she was too drunk uh-huh. and whenever i got into my friend's car i was like <laughs> What happened? Wait. <laughs> she threw up all oh, over oh. herself. It's gross, man. It was so funny. She was like, no, I feel great now. <laughs> you did gross. feel really good after that. Dude, That's I felt thing. so good after. At the B&B, I was like, oh, I'm so glad I did that. <laughs> and it's crazy because, dude, you I drove woke back up. home, huh? Huh? Like you drove? Yeah. Yeah, it would have been a terrible car ride. Yeah. And, uh, yeah, how long ago weren't you? Um, it's crazy because when I woke up, the house was, like, silent as fuck because everybody was asleep. And I remember thinking, like, I'm pretty sure somebody's going to come in and, like, you know, tend to me because they're going to hear it. And nobody came in. I was just, <laughs> fine. just all alone. <laughs> the main character Damn. syndrome. I know. I think everyone's going to wake up, I offer know. me some breakfast. And <laughs> <laughs> I have a Chris is laying there. Chris. Like, Chris, we're going to get 
Kawa. Oh, Chris. Oh, you baby. <laughs> and the exact opposite. <laughs> <laughs> like, it was like, shut the fuck up. <laughs> Look, like, somebody God. throws a rock Who's throwing up right now? They start stoning me. Exactly. <laughs> Chris making fake throw up noises. Hey, me and, uh. Bre- <laughs> me and Brenda drive out there just to throw stones at I'm you. I'm just waiting. <laughs> <laughs> Help! Hey, uh. hey! You kind of look like Lord Farquaad. <laughs> I told him. Dude, you're like a rough. Like like a twenty-five dollar hooker. <laughs> 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 It's the bangs. They're not even bangs. They're like side bangs. I know. What's going on there? You look like you got caught in the (laughs) world of wind. What would Chris look like? You know what you should do? You should dye your hair black. I think it would kind of look cool I don't think I would like that. But then I'd have to dye my eyebrows black because my eyebrows are really light. Yeah. No, So you have to do that too? I think so. That would be just once. I don't think so. Just one eyebrow? (laughs) With With the colored eyes? I would love to try it. I wish I had dark hair so I could do the thing where you dye like parts of it like blonde or like bleach it you know yeah, no? yeah. you could do that you could dye your hair dark and then that's add so that. much work your hair's pretty, like not crazy blonde so it might still i dyed uh, a green for halloween for the joker yeah mm, was all right. i had green in my hair that oh my you guys favorite. were on for that podcast wow full circle moment yeah that was I, fun that was remember the one. fucking hairspray didn't work it wasn't yeah, yeah i had to buy you a new video. one because i'm painting yeah. my face Ready? yeah oh. <laughs> Why is it not green? It's not green. I don't know. It's glow in the dark. That's why I was scared. Because I was like, what if it doesn't even show up unless it's in the dark, you know? <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> Let me see. <laughs> oh, Chris, it's not green. <laughs> it's, not. it's not green. You go go get some. No way. <laughs> yeah. I called both of you guys and both were like, I can't. I, I don't know. You hey. just weren't giving me an answer. I was like, yes or no. You know? People, no, I'm really I'm good. not okay. going to circle back because we already discussed that on the podcast of why I thought did Brenda should have did. Yeah. We did. So I'm not going to discuss that. Yeah. They can see it in this pod. So. We did. Um, I'm going to check the camera and see if your camera's oh, still going. I hate how it's You don't want to compete. I'm too fast on my feet and you know where I be. The club. Yeah, we're back. I'll oh, back it. Talking about clubbing. Um, can't get away from it. Can't I have get a away question from it. It's for like you guys. No offense, Chris. Have oh. you guys ever had like? Have you guys got like? I don't know. Have you gotten angry at Chris like with anything? Because Chris is so like cheap. Like, have you yeah. been like frustrated with him? You know what's crazy? I think our worst, and this is less cheap, but more just the whole overthinking. I feel like we. It was really. Well, that's bad. not what like, I asked. So. Bitch. <laughs> <laughs> like eight months hey. ago or something like that when I was. I feel like I was always getting frustrated at you for like doing the weird things. I think it's because you're in a relationship, actually. That I was sense. about to say that. Yeah. I was, I was just say. getting so frustrated with all the stuff you'd say. Cheap wise, not really. He's used only, to it now. Yeah, like I'm used to it. And we don't do things that require that much money. But there is a couple of times where I do get kind of frustrated that he's just like, he doesn't. He didn't want to play. For, he didn't want to pay for your Gatorade <laughs> at the corner store. <laughs> but I think he. Like, he's cheap, and I don't even notice it sometimes. Like, you know? Like, but in your head, you're probably thinking, like... It's like the plastic thing. Like, you think of the plastic thing, and I just think you're saying no for something. Like, but for, for no why. reason. Yeah, 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 yeah. So, same with the cheapness. It's like, he might <clears throat> want to guide his, like, um, the event to this way or say no to this. And I'm not thinking it's because he's cheap. I'm just thinking he doesn't want to do it or he wants to do something else, you know? Yeah. I, it, I'm, like, insecure about it. And I feel like you're just more impulsive. You know, with like purchases and stuff. You're yeah. Like, oh fuck, we should do this, and yeah. it's like, you'd be like at San Francisco. He's like, we should get like a tour bus ride. You know, but like who that kind of shit. Do that? Huh? Who wants to really do that? I mean, I would. Oh, you tour the city. <laughs> see, <laughs> I could totally see that happening. And yeah, and then I'm always I like, mean, eh, like, should we? You know. Yeah. <laughs> I feel Somehow. like I would be like, should we? Because I'm like, okay. You know what I want to <laughs> do? I want to do the one where you're biking and you're drinking. Oh, I did I that did in that, Vegas, and I didn't like it. Oh. I you mean, don't it really was have fine. to fight. So I got plastered, but like, it was just hell expensive. But yeah, it was all <laughs> expensive, and I was just like, bro, I, I could just drink actually. somewhere. And they make you like, you bring all your liquor, and they just drop you off at a bunch of bars, and you just like buy more liquor there. And I'm like, I could just fucking bar hop, you know? Like, I don't know. Ooh, it just yeah. seems unnecessary. Is that illegal to drive a bicycle when you're drunk? 
Well, you're not but driving. You're not really, Somebody, yeah, the sober person's like steering the whole thing. Uh, and yeah, when you and pedal, you honestly don't even have to pedal. Like the when you pedal, there's no resistance. So you're like, why am I pedaling? Like, no, I remember nothing. whenever I did it in Vegas, no one was pedaling. People just had their feet on the little stand, and yeah. I was pedaling, and I was like. I guess I'll pedal for all of us, but really it was like some other guy controlling everything. I remember we told the the lady allegiance to, to the, the flag, flag of the United, United States, States of America, America and, and to, to the republic for which it stands, one nation, nation under God, God indivisible, with liberty, liberty and justice, justice for all. Oh, wow, you've been out of school for a while, huh? <laughs> yeah, I, was, I was overthinking every line. I didn't remember it. Should anyway. just come to you naturally. What are you saying? Should we do the Christian flag salute? Oh. <laughs> oh, not that one. <laughs> Anyways, uh, put that away. Put that thing Wait, can away. You guys, can you guys do the Star Spangled Banner? Oh, say can you see? We might get copyrighted, copyrighted by the dawn's early light. Was the stripes a red flare at the twilight's last gleam? Stripes and bright stars <laughs> through the perilous flight. <laughs> oh, so <laughs> hey, you take our wigs off for the like when people take their hats off. Twilight <laughs> flag. We already said that. <laughs> oh, bright stars. <laughs> Who's <laughs> rust stripes <laughs> and oh, bright stars? What's the last lines? We gotta close this. <laughs> Wait. And the home. No. The rocket's oh break. Oh my god, I can't do this anymore. The bombs oh, bursting. <laughs> gave hey, proof that shit is through the <laughs> night <laughs> that our flag. <laughs> can we say that? <laughs> okay, can we do the harmonizing thing real quick? Oh. I always want to do that. I forget. Ready? Three, two, one. Mm-hmm. All right. Oh. Oh, no, you're supposed to go like this. I didn't like the. Oh, you were a band nerd. I, I forgot. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Band nerd. Band nerd. <laughs> band nerd. Oh. <laughs> Unfortunately. Wait, did you see some crazy stuff go down at band camp? Yeah. You went to band camp? Was it like the movies? Was it like American Pie? Were they sucking and blowing? Was it the, hey, the trumpet was the only thing they're blowing, huh? Hey. <laughs> 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 um, there was some crazy stuff. <laughs> Can you give examples? It wasn't so much. A, it wasn't These even like birds. the band band camp. It was just band in general. People? Like just in was general. it like the drama like kids? I always heard the drama kids got down. Yeah, they got down. How did they get down? Um, We used to have this room and it was like the uniform room and then it was just hella funny because for some reason there's like a ladder and then mm. like just a flat surface and people would just literally like go up there and fuck or like really yeah or like there were three practice rooms and people would just go in there during lunch and just like because they wouldn't lock from the were they band kids or just regular? band kids oh wow Ooh. and it was like inner band kids <laughs> wow yeah it's always the quiet ones I feel, yeah i feel like you i feel like though we it. had like a big group of pe- like especially my senior year like a big group of people that weren't like like you know i feel like we mingled well with the rest of the school it wasn't like yeah. those are band nerds a lot of people don't even know i was in band people are like i talk about it now and they're like you were in band yeah. and i was like all four years <laughs> what Damn. what what did you play i did the flute oh, well so you're not really in band Wait, Wait, can, you, can you get down <laughs> on the flute? <laughs> can you actually play it really well? Yeah, I play. I, I love play it. Can play it right now? Yeah, let me just whip my flute <laughs> out. <laughs> the skin flute? Um, I played the flute since literally <laughs> fifth grade. <laughs> Harmonica? <laughs> Harmonica. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. What made you want to do it? Um, I wanted to do band in fifth grade because I was new to the school. I went from like Riverbank schools to Modesto schools. Mm. And then so I did, I wanted to play the flute and then I just continued it in sixth and seventh and eighth grade because they would go to Disneyland or Great America. So that was fun. So I enjoyed doing that. And then in high school, the band director actually reached out to me because I wasn't going to do it. And then he said like, hey, I heard like you're in band from your middle school and I wanted you to come try with us and then i went to like one of their practices and i hated it but Ah. then i just like stuck it out and we ended up winning like championships my freshman year so i just like kind of stuck with it and then i remember senior year i did not want to do it like i had a little boyfriend at the time and he was like in football and so i wanted to go to his games but we had practice literally three to nine 
on you Friday. You wouldn't play at the games? Well, okay. Uh, so, not all the time. That year, uh, especially senior year, the concession stands, they would, like, give us half of their profits, like, towards the band. Oh, wow. So, that's the only reason we would go play. But senior year, they were like, we're not doing that this year. We're giving mm. it all to the football. So, we were like, so then why are we going to miss our practice time? So, senior year, we weren't going to go. Yeah. And so, I was like, I'm not even going to be able to see him play, you know, whatever. Yeah. And so, I was like, I don't want to do band this year. And my dad literally didn't talk to me for two weeks. Wow. Yeah. So I was like, you know what? So you're just... throwing your fucking life away? <laughs> <There>. <laughs> no, literally. <laughs> I don't understand. Yeah. <laughs> so I feel like it, it, is the flute relatively um, cheaper than any other, like the, the other instruments? I just, just, just the instrument I chose. No, no, I'm not saying that's why, but like, I'm just saying, is it? Because like, I feel like the other instruments have hella pieces, right? No, it's a three piece instrument. With the little mouth thing, huh? It's one and then the beak. middle and then the little piece at the end. Um, Do you have to keep it? I just had my own flute because I uh, played for so long. You still have a flute? You have a flute at home? Yeah. It, actually, it's Melina's flute. She's never oh. played Melina that little played fiddle f- for me. <laughs> it's in the shed. <laughs> I'll bring it out one day. <laughs> Dude, so you yes. don't play anymore? I know how, but I don't. It was never you really my thing. It was. Get down? I mean, it seems I therapeutic, you know, just a little <laughs> flute sesh. It was really never my <laughs> thing. Like, I think I just did it because, like, and then freshman year, I made a lot of friends in there. So I just, like, my friends were doing it sophomore year. And then my friends were doing it senior year, junior year. And then senior year, my dad didn't talk to me for two weeks. And so I was like, all right, I'll be banned. You should start learning, like, <laughs> the most, like, trendy current songs on the flute and then make TikToks of it and you'll oh, be famous. Yeah, I should. You actually. could do, like, <laughs> that <laughs> boy's a, a liar good, on the yeah. flute. Okay, like, Edna. <laughs> Wait a yeah. minute. I know <laughs> how to, I know how to play like a majority <laughs> of the instruments though because like I just would practice them whenever I was there and we just had like extra mouthpieces or extra oh, reeds. Wow. Oh shit. But I never like perfected anything. You know what I mean? But Yeah. Cool. You're yeah, jack of all trades, master none. Well, you know. I fucking hate that. Tra- that <laughs> I know. Quote. I hate that quote so much. <laughs> I think it's longer than that too. It's not just that. Really? It's like but knowing all is better than m- one. Ma- knowing one or some shit. Like, what? Oh my God, dude. Are you thinking of that one person's bio that it's in? Yeah. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm, I'm sorry. sorry. <laughs> uh, but I've heard it like continuously. Like since I heard it, th- since I read it then, I've heard that quote like a few times and I just don't like it. Like, well, those are two horns on the same goat, darling. <laughs> <laughs> I heard that in a, mo- in a movie and I'm going to try to start saying it more. I hate it because it doesn't even, it didn't even it doesn't go. make sense at Chris, all. you know what hella made me laugh? The pod with your mom. Whenever you were it. saying stuff. That your mom would quote and that your friends hella loved. Yeah. I was laughing like, my ass This is where it comes off. from. Hey, say it again. I want, I want to hear one or two. The highway to hell is paved with good <laughs> intentions. No, that one wasn't that funny. I love no, that you one. Know so what made so made no, you know what made me laugh? That was good, but one of them was hella He's funny. He's a chip off the old block. <laughs> no, what made me <laughs> laugh was how you told her about how you lost your virginity. And yeah. she was just like, Chris. I was fucked. Yeah. That? I didn't think she'd be disappointed like that. I literally was like, oh, the whole time. Yeah, it was so like because that was real. Like yeah, I know. Like I'm afraid for my parents to watch this and hear about my coochie whack. So (laughs) imagine like. (laughs) Do you think they watch it? (laughs) She told her dad she was coming. I told him I was coming, but like I wouldn't send him the link. (laughs) You do you you follow him or anything? Yeah, but I. He's not gonna be like. Where's the podcast? No. Uh, He uh, he would have said that about the last one. It's funny. I I don't like your mom at all. Why? Because she called you a little bitch. Because she called me a bitch one time. What were you not? I was one? stuck between a rock and a hard place. Mm. My girlfriend, my girlfriend, <laughs> hey, didn't want me. They've talked about you this know what? Like my mom times. is my mom is such a great person. <laughs> so I think you're just. Judging I mean, that's her like the only thing I honesty. have to reference is that one interaction. It was the honesty know? that hurt you. Yeah, sometimes the truth hurts. Exactly, and it yeah. seems like it stuck with you for a long time. Oh yeah, that was like 2020. Move yeah. on. And I think there was some resentment towards you from it too. From me? I'm just can kidding. You, can you give us some context? Yeah. So oh, you could just watch that other we pod. We talked about this on the last pod, oh, shit, but just in a nutshell, <laughs> my ex-girlfriend didn't want me to go to this party, and you and all my other friends wanted me to go, and then you had your mo- you were FaceTiming because you were trying to convince me to go, and then your mom was there, and you were like, Mom, Chris doesn't want to go to this party. And she was like, Tom, stop being a little bitch. Yeah. I, bought, I bought you a fedora. It's still in my closet, by the way. Really? Yeah. Can you give it to me still? No. That's you you didn't go. For. You really bought me one? Yes. Why? You because know I wasn't was, going. I thought you were going. Yeah, it was before you up. told me no. Damn. Did yeah. you guys go shopping together? And you guys didn't even really know each other that well back then. I oh, know. Yeah, we went shopping together, right? I talk shit all the time. I'm like, how did okay. Jaime go and Chris did it? <laughs> no, like I barely knew you at that time. What that mean? We were bowling <laughs> like one time and we worked together for like <laughs> two months. But you were seasonal. Yeah, I, I, I'm, just, I'm just a down motherfucker for real. Yeah. Well, Jaime just hangs out with people he doesn't even know. Or like that's pretty cool. Like you really do that back in the no days. Like, 
No, not like I'm not like, saying why? he doesn't like you guys. That was a joke, but he does. Like, there's people here. He's like, I don't really want to hang out with them, and then he still does it. Yeah, because it's just like for the plot. No, uh, no. I mean, I just <laughs> like. I don't know. I don't want to say. No. I like FOMO. You know, it's like fuck it. I'll, I'll have a good time. But there's certain people where I'm like super not crazy and inclined to hang out with. They're like they're still my friends. I'm just like. Rather not just because I have like you guys and stuff, not you, 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 yeah. you and other people. <laughs> and I'm like, but I don't know when I get invited. I'm like, yeah, maybe I'll just go. You're you like, know? if it's in the, if I have time, yeah, why not? Yeah, like no. I'm sure there. I'm sure at the time when I was invited to your party, it was like I was party. excited, but I, I didn't really know anyone there, but like heavily, you know, it it just because it was it close party. coworkers. It was not my party. Okay, well, you know. <laughs> what party? The one we're talking about right now? Yeah. Vanna Nights. There was literally not even any Coles people. It was just me and my ex-boyfriend. Hmm. No. Boo. Yeah. What? He might. He's probably watching this. I, I feel like fuck. he would watch it because hey. you're on it. I don't, I don't think fuck. so. Hey. Ask me if I give a fuck. <laughs> hey, do you think? Actually, I want to. Uh, you could. You could believe this. This part, but do you think your ex-girlfriend watches the pod still? Fuck no. 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 We haven't talked in, since September. Why do you think she would have hit you up and been like, stop fucking mentioning me? She would have said something. Dude, she took me off everything. Like, she took me off yeah, all social media. I'm think sure she doesn't watch it. Yeah, but also, you're on YouTube, dude. She could just type in. I don't think she would. I mean, maybe she'll search it and be like, oh, should he still doing it? And then that's it. Like, I, I think, think she's she heard if about it a few times out there. Like, maybe, yeah. Like, oh, he's, I see like, his podcast still. Yeah, you know, yeah. <laughs> she's probably, it's probably in her recommendations all the time. Yeah. Anyways. <laughs> <laughs> We're back. Uh, <laughs> oh shit! Uh, Wait, what? Uh, maybe we'll see. I'll think about it. The <laughs> mentions her every pod. <laughs> Pussy for real. Uh, <laughs> just kidding. Fuck you. No, no, no. Cut. Hey, it's oh, different. Hey, hey, hey. Cut out. Cut you don't understand. We're just saying. Would just see the just because you still talk to your ex fucking every day. Hey. How does he talk to his ex? They hey. broke up with like two years ago. No, I don't talk to her consistently. Oh, but you talked to I me? had your laptop one night and she was texting you. Oh. Hey, and Chris was responding. Send nudes. Send me some sugar. Yeah. <laughs> like a little text. Hey, imagine she's like, hi, man, you can't do this every day. <laughs> huh. Well, well look, who, look, who, uh, you know, look who shuts up now when the exes start coming off. Yeah. Hey, it's different with hey, me. Hey, hey, I on. shut up real quick, too, though. I don't know if you yeah, caught that drift. It's like, not a good look. Brenda's, yeah. barely, bar- Brenda's barely into the dating scene. She already went back with the guy twice, so... <laughs> I mean, yeah, it's all right, we never d- shut up, Hyman. We never <laughs> even dated. Uh, it okay, wasn't serious. It wasn't serious. Hey, Brenda. Okay, bye. <laughs> That's what he said. That's an insider, isn't it? <laughs> I sent a nice, long, heartfelt message. You broke up with him over text. Hey, and then he said we were dating. He said, well, real fuck, to him. honestly, I didn't ghost him. He pretty much said, honestly, I'm not reading that. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and then I said, he said that. Yeah. And then I said, okay, well, can you read it out loud? Can you put the screenshots? On yeah, the can you read the breakup no. text out loud? No. I just want to see what you, how you would say it. No, no she, she was nice, and I... Okay. Me angry? I'm going <laughs> to just summarize it. I That's said, I basically said, don't you? respond to, like, the message, right? Yeah, yeah. And I said... Can you pass me the potato chips? <clears throat> Sorry. Basically, I said, I'm not, like... Okay. Do you really want the chips? What'd you say, Brenda? I'm cutting him. I said, no, I'm no, no, say it all. Letting, no, I'm not reading it exactly because it's a little cringy. Girl. I was a little too nice. I said, I'm letting you go for real this time. I know I've done this multiple times. I'm really sorry. I'm not giving you the attention. I should be. I'm going to be honest because I just don't feel like it. And I know that's not okay. I know you have feelings. I said, I just feel like we weren't clicking as much as I would have wanted to. I did keep going back because um, because he would let I her. I thought I would. Yeah, he would let me. So he'd make you come? No, mm, fuck. Hi, <laughs> Hey, I said it wasn't serious. Okay, let's give, give the none people... None of that, none of that. Um, da 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 I said, whatever, you're a great person. I said, I just haven't developed those feelings for you. And I said, not everyone is meant to be together, right? LOL, me trying to ease like the blow. Wow, that was sweet. Well, that's and then I said, poetic. I know it seems like I wasn't trying, but I really was. And I do care. I wish you nothing but the best. I hope you have a great time. In Vegas, he was going to Vegas or some shit. And I said, please don't get that American flag tattoo. Because he told me he was going to get an American no, flag tattoo. No, you was did like, not oh, talk to a guy okay, who you was even considering that. He, no is he, he I laughed. laughed. I laughed when he saying. said that. Good. He said, I'm not going to tell you because you're going to laugh. And I was like, please Just tell the American me. flag? That's what you Yeah, wanted? like on his arm. What a fucking... I was like, please don't do that. No way. That's Anyways, oh, I said... I'm not coming back from that one. I won't text... I said, I promise I won't text you this time. song. 
Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you guys didn't even fucking sing it right. Yeah. 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 It's actually not the lyrics. It's really just He ties the whole lyrics in the comments. <laughs> <laughs> and then he just said, K bye. And then he said, No, he just said, K bye. And that was it. Yeah. And then he, Texting I literally ben. text Brenda. I was like, He's going to send some shit after that. And then yeah. he did. Of course. He always do that. He's like so yeah, he, hot headed. He like, wanted to like, be like petty. And then he yeah. Wanted, yeah, he wanted yeah. to explode. And then, yeah. Because yeah. how long said, was it after? Uh, like 20 minutes. Yeah, definitely. And then he said, I just, I, he said, I don't want your opinions or your good luck. <laughs> good looks? Good luck. Oh. He said And then that? he said, just He's say petty. you don't want to do whatever this is. And he said, no hard feelings. I don't care to look through all that, whatever you're trying to say. And then he said, don't take it the wrong way. I'm not being rude. Hey, like, he probably nice read that girl. shit 10 times. I know. And yeah. I said. He definitely called his friend. <laughs> and I responded and I said, no, you are rude. You could have just not responded. I was trying to be nice rather than ghost you. Maybe you should work on controlling your emotions before you talk to people. Please don't Bitch. text me anymore with the laughing emoji. Oh, he definitely texted you. Huh? And then he, he said, definitely he texted me. He, he definitely texted me. did. He that said, made me so mad when he did. He said, no, I didn't God. mean to sound rude. Seriously, I was trying to figure out what you were saying. I do appreciate the text letting me know. But since you want to be rude, why would I care if you of all peaceful people ghost me the fuck? And then I said, the fuck? like two days ago. Two days before that, he had texted me. He said, miss you. So I re I requoted that text. Oh, he huh. said, why would I care if you of all people like ghost me the fuck? And I re like, <laughs> He told you miss you after you, got, you already No, this was before. before. I replied and I said, this you, LMF, LMFAO, bye. Oh, damn, damn. damn. And then he said, in all honesty, you're right. I should have left it. I'm not that smart. Best of luck to you. And then he said, I get you're mad, understandably. And then he said, I just told you this because you were being rude to me. Does it mean it's right? No, I'm not right. And after that, I didn't have him respond. This was like last week. Hmm. But I was trying to be nice and he got all mad. Like, I was like, all right. All yeah. right, fool. Like, I think you're just done with your shit. Can I read you guys? Yeah, yeah. So, oh, wow. My oh, first also, Jaime texted me like a couple days ago. Hey. Huh? He was like, <laughs> <What> <laughs> I, I swear. <laughs> I, I swear. It was at night. And no. Jaime was like, <laughs> that was I miss you. I swear. I did not text you that. Yes, you did. Let's see the receipts. I think it was the fucking Saturday of the Airbnb. Oh. Were you drunk? No, no. Hey, okay. Hyman didn't text hey. me. Hey, all I'm saying is Hyman didn't text me, so just, he texted me. Just I just been, said, and he also, he also, he also I just said, said, I said, hope need you, you. No, he said, need you so bad. <laughs> I didn't say that. <laughs> He said, I need you so bad. Hey, right I was scared. Wait, right really? There. No, he didn't. <laughs> Dead ass. I, was well, I, 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 oh, I hope it's not COVID because I need you so bad. <laughs> Wait, Brenda, I say one more say time. That. Clear, I need you. He, he said, because I, I said, <laughs> oh, I said I know. They wa- I said I know they want to meet you so bad. Bitch, <laughs> I've been thinking I was saying something when I was a little tipsy. <laughs> okay, see hey, how hey, easy. Hey, see how easy. Mic. Oh, sorry. Oh. See how easy it is to lie. I didn't say that. Jaime was scared. I was joking. Yeah, I was like, I can see it. I can see it. Jaime was, 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 was scared, scared his ex-girlfriend was going to watch his video. Jaime was like, bro, I can't let her know. Jaime's a shysty. Shysty. No, Jaime didn't text me Jaime was trying to riz you up. He did say he hopes I feel better, though. I hope I feel better. I feel better. Wait, what are you going to read us? All right, so my first. My first? Not real girl, but this was like, you know, I was a weirdo my whole life. So I never got like anything from girls ever. You're still a weirdo. Exactly. All right, wait a minute. <laughs> <laughs> and wasn't necessary. No Riz. But this is so like this is the first time I kind of had like a mutual thing going on, and uh, she ended it of course <clears throat> after of course. we like I think held hands and like maybe maybe kissed. This oh. was like early high school. Oh, 2016. Yeah. Oh shit. Yeah, it was. Great. Hey, you still have you messages have from that then? Shit. You're, right? you're delusional. He's a maniac, you're bro. Really hey, delusional. no wonder why Jaime doesn't have storage on his phone. Dude, he has 100. Uh, he sent me a screenshot today. It's 112 gigabytes. Hey, I'm never telling Jaime shit. 112 gigabytes <laughs> just for messages. Hey, man. My that. phone is 64 gigabytes <laughs> total. <laughs> she said, this is, so she ended things, and this is our text. And we we're, we're trying to delete messages, so this is when I remembered that she sent this. So look, uh, rate this exchange, because okay. I think it's pretty good. Uh-huh. So this is her. I'm sorry for doing this to you, but for the last few weeks, I've not been happy with myself. This is pretty rough, oh actually. When I was reading this, I was like, Jesus. I shocked I was. <laughs> God, what did I do? Okay. Restart. You see, I try to change myself so people won't judge me, and I force myself to turn into something I'm really not. This just isn't working out, and it's causing me so much stress. And I want to. Get, I don't want to continue hurting you, so I'm shutting this down before it gets worse. Don't get me wrong. You're a great guy, but I'm just not ready 
you will find someone better. She didn't Solid. like you. That was good. But yeah. I was like, like honestly, I was so shook because I was like, changed. Like, we would just hang out every once in a while and whatever, yeah. you know? Anyways, <laughs> so I said, bitch, don't just get me. Okay, bye. I said. I'm not reading all of that. <laughs> this was a nice response. I said, no, I understand. I don't want you to change if you're not comfortable with how you are. And I, would, I don't want to make you feel like that. I'm sorry if I did. But I'm glad you told me and I understand. And then there was a couple more other things, but I don't want to read all that. That's all right. But. It's all right, Hammy. You don't have to cry. It's 2016. You know, it's, just, it's just hard when you think everything's fine. And you get this. <laughs> I didn't good. come this far just to come this far. You know? <laughs> hey, that was a good okay. response. Solid. That was nice, right? Solid. There was yeah. more niceness. But yeah, she could have ghosted you, but she gave you an explanation. <laughs> yeah. But, well, you know, no, I, I feel like she was just 16 and she was going through like. I mean, you're a perv. Her like emo phase. <laughs> I was 16 too, bitch. <laughs> where she was just like really, you know, angsty. You're so you guys are like really into these emo girls is what I'm hearing. <laughs> was she? Is more, she? Uh, I still no. see her shadows in and my room. And they still talk. I have her on B-Real. That's it. Oh, Which is actually nuts because we didn't have any contact after that for a while. Do you guys still use B-Real? Hell Every yeah. day. Oh, I shit. just re-downloaded it and started using it again. I don't know if you guys noticed. Yeah, I'd be I kind of want to delete my B-Real and do one from right now. Huh? I kind of want yeah, to do it. My Fuck it. Fuck it. Cheers. Yeah, we should definitely call it. Is there any uh, anything else you guys want to say or any story or anything? Mm, All right, um, never mind. I don't know. I think um, I think we did pretty good here. I had an earring when I was little and I pooped it out. You found it in the poop? Yep, it was gold, and I would take it out. <coughs> I would Wait, take my it turn. out with my ear. Uh-huh. I would Jesus, take it out like it's kind of gnarly. Take it out of my ear, and I would play with it like in my mouth. <sighs> and Did you shit on it? No. Oh, <laughs> hey, Marina. I remember one day I was laying down. Oh, I won't <laughs> be able to post again. Uh, Marina, I remember when I? Uh, <laughs> sorry, 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 sorry. No good. That's no, okay. Marina, remember at Kohl's we would have <laughs> these like giant tubs full of just oh, thumbtacks, my. just thumbtacks, like hundreds like of the thumbtacks. And I would just play with them, like yeah, with it my would hands. freak me out. And she hated it. She'd be like, "Chris, stop!" Like literally, just putting his hand all the way in tax. You know what's even crazier? When I was in fifth grade, I used to get thumbtacks and put them in my mouth, and I would just have them in my mouth like You're the whole class. Freak. And I remember my friends were like, "What the fuck are you doing?" And I was <laughs> like, "I remember at the time thinking like, well, I won't swallow it. But, like, imagine if I swallowed that. Like, oh my god, that bad. would rip your intestines. That it fuck me up, dude. It'd be bad." Oh crazy. God, that could be bad. No, yeah. literally, that would rip yeah. your intestines. Literally. It'd be fucked. All right. Silly. All right. Anything else? Well, thanks for being on. You didn't let me finish my earring story. No, it's Sorry. good. All right. I get, so you get the inclusion. You conclusion. swallowed an earring and you had to shit it out. Yeah. What is, what's there left? Did you go to the hospital? I didn't. Did okay. you need antibiotics? <laughs> that's scary, too, though, because that's a little sharp, you know, a little pointy. Well, I'm not telling you. So. Oh, well. Her mom had Anyways, I was laying down <laughs> <laughs> on the edge of the bed. I remember this vividly. I think I was like five years old. Uh-huh. And um, I would take it out and I would play with it. And then one day I just swallowed it. And I was like, <gasps> mom, 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 me lo pasé. <laughs> and then she was like, que, que. And I was like, el arete. <laughs> and then she was like, hi, you, Lisa. And then she was like, si te lo pasaste. And I was like, mm-hmm. <laughs> and then like she was like, pues vamos a tener que esperar because I could only u- I usually only get uh-huh. like gold earrings, so that's just expensive, you know. And they don't buy me them. Fuck. Like she's like, we're using that again. <laughs> <laughs> Damn. They don't buy me those like very often, you uh-huh. know. So she's like, we have to wait for that shit. How old were you? Literally wait. I think I was like five. You know what's Damn. so funny? I remember that shit so vividly. Whenever I was little, um, anytime I would like, if I had a little like just something small, and I'd be like, oh my god, where'd it go? Like lose it. Mm-hmm. I'd always be like, did I swallow it? Like why? <laughs> <laughs> why did I think that? <laughs> Why did my brain down the hatch? <laughs> did Marina yeah. go down the hatch? So down the hatch. all the time I would. That Maybe was you did eat your boogers, man. I would never. <laughs> my mom, my mom got like this bucket, right? And I would poop like in the little tray, and she would like dissect the poop every time until that earring came up, and it came up. She washed it and put it back and in my ear. Right it's like the kitchen no, like sifter. <laughs> <laughs> it's not this one. It's not this one. But do you yeah. still have? Do you still have the earring? I don't think so. Maybe in my dad's like gold collection or something. Fuck, that's gnarly that she yeah, dug through the shit. Yeah. They kind of have that. So you that some crazy shit. Hey. <laughs> hey. Wait, how old were you? Shit. How old were you again? Sorry. Bye. You're Fine. taking hella shits too. Were you pooping? So you're pooping in the toilet by then? Were you pooping yeah. solid or not? I was potty trained. So was it weird to poop in a tray? Huh? Do you remember pooping in the tray? No, I just remember my mom's dissecting it in like a tray or something. Oh, that's so See, I don't think I'm going to be a good mother because huh? I would never I do that. Yeah, I'd be like, fuck, we'll buy it. I'll fuck like, it, well, you know. Came and it went. Yeah. It really came and it really went Literally. down the toilet. I feel like if Not you much. were. Oh, no, never mind. I was going to say, because if you're wiping, you might be able to feel it, but it's in the toilet. Ooh. Unless you get stuck. That's <laughs> gnarly, man. No, I remember uh, my mom always talks about this story. 
I guess I was constipated as like a baby. I don't know how old I was, like one or two probably. <laughs> and she said I was just crying and crying and crying for like so long. And she knew it was because I had to poop. Your dad didn't help? And she said she put her fingers like <laughs> up my butt and like pulled the poop out. My cousin, no. my yeah. cousin's dad had to do that to her dog. <laughs> <laughs> Ew, a dog is so much worse. Ugh. Yeah, a dog's bad. It swallowed a chicken bone. I can't believe oh. that worked. Like maybe it just was like a hard poop that was stuck right there or something. Yeah, maybe it was I'm just thinking like, like my this, little asshole. Like, this. like, how do you get your fingers? That's what in I'm there? saying. Like I can't even imagine. But like, well, how's I mean, that even a? There's suppositories for babies too, so sometimes you gotta be shoving shit up <clears> the baby's butthole. <clears throat> yeah, but no way she did that instead of just going to like the doctors or something. Maybe she Damn. googled it, but like not googled it. <laughs> did you she know? fix the problem? Yeah, she said it came out and I stopped crying. That's crazy. All right. Well, well <laughs> thank note. you guys for being on. <laughs> Woo! We appreciate it. Hopefully, y- this is the last time you guys see him. We can't have him more than <laughs> three times. Jesus. I have a limit on twice. Okay. Yeah, you're next then. <laughs> you got your limit. <laughs> After that, you gotta start <laughs> paying us. Well, <laughs> um, I don't give a shit. You asked us to be on here, but all right. Shovel, shovel, shovel. We're not doing that. I'm not doing that. Shit. <laughs> uh, thank you guys so much editors. for the support. I hope you guys are enjoying uh, the content. Um, What's it called? Real quick, shout out Mosaic. We'll do an actual one later. Yeah. But shout out Mosaic. Don't forget to uh, go check out their website and use code COZY uh, for 10% off mm-hmm. with your additional 10% off if it's your first purchase and free shipping if you're local. So don't forget to check them out. Uh, Chris, you want to say anything? I thought there was a script. Wow. Thanks for coming on. Like, if you're still here, like the video, subscribe, leave a comment too. Nobody's going to fucking see it. Don't be all overthinking about leaving a comment. Okay. Okay, if you're this far, it's the least you could do. <laughs> Just, Just think, if we had 10,000 subs, you guys would be commenting. Yeah. You'd be like, I was here, I was here since they're at fucking yeah. 600. Yeah, you could show people. You could screenshot, look at, dude, I was there. So comment yeah. now, and it will be it's your be worth time a lot. capsule. <laughs> it's going to be worth a lot one day. Comment Anyways. now and get this free t-shirt. Oh, <laughs> shit. <laughs> Twilight t-shirt. Comment Yay. now, and you get a kiss from Brenda. Oh, comment. <laughs> no. Comment what team you are. Are you, you team Jacob, <laughs> or are you team Edward? Hey, I'll have you know. No, yeah, no. team Jacob or team Edward. Um, and who has the best wig? Yeah, who's the, who's pulling it off the best? <laughs> I met with the glasses. You're like an old hag. I mean, it looks <laughs> like he wants to curl up with the good book. <laughs> <laughs> Am I steady? <laughs> Am I steady? That's good. That's good. <sighs> All right. Goodbye. All right, guys. Peace. Hopefully, they take Later. us out to dinner. <laughs>